during the course of the day which is also as that the respondent shall not withdraw the amount till the next date of hearing mr dk puch learned advocate for the applicant for purchase for some time there is a matter on the one thing that we want to do and how to do the amount of the statement to continue till the Number twenty five to thirty one. Number twenty six. Twenty six. Six. Mentioning on behalf of Anki Matmuda. Six note. So should all the other matters may be adjourned. I have given the serial number. Okay. So all the matters of Mr. Matmuda are to be adjourned. Adjourned. But in Sarah be on vacation. I am your friend. Number twenty nine. Yes. Twenty nine. I may be permitted to withdraw. I mean, last time I am ending the order of the exhibit five passed by the learned of tribunal. I mean, last time transfer that I moved the application as per the CPC before the learned yes. Yes. tribunal. I already moved the application. Yes. 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 Uh, six permission to withdraw the caption application as the applicant government has already approached the cabinet. Cabinet filled for the application under order nine. Has already oh. filled an application under order thirty nine rule three capital A of the Code of Civil Procedure. The yes. question is maybe decided by according to law or something. Yes, that will be will be decided. The request is accepted. The application is disposed of as well. If you oppose, say no. Thank you. Apply. Yes. Sir, number forty-two to forty-six. Forty-seven to forty-two. Malab judge. Thirty-eight. Thirty-eight. Yes. Yes. Recollect is that matter between Mr. Me and Mr. Sanjanwala Senior. Yes. That seven ribbon and that we wanted to argue finally. Yes, this was true. Today I have some difficulty here. I pray for just tomorrow. Try career. Tomorrow? Then let it go next week. Very well. Twenty second then. Twenty second. Grateful. Twenty ninth. I'm so sorry, Maharaj. 25th or 26th, whatever is convenient. 25th. I'm grateful. You have uh, taken the consent of the yeah. yes. I my Some of my matters will clash, otherwise we are both ready, yeah. unfortunately. Yeah. Mr. Yeah. Devin Kharif, you are missing a council appearing for Mr. Madhuda? Yes. For Mr. S.P. Madhuda, one of the people from with the consent of the other side from or just for some time, yes, he has some difficulty too. Twenty fifth. Twenty fifth. I'm great. Twenty fifth. Twenty fifth. Much of. Lordship, matter is serial number thirty nine. A sick note has been filed in the matter, requesting for a short date. You are for Mr. I am for the advocate of the appellant, Mr. Prashant Sharma. Mr. Prashant Sharma. Yes, sir.
So, when the magic work is done, the problem is done. So, what do you think? 44 to 46. 47 to 52. Serial number 49, my lord. Uh, here for the respondent, I, am, I have instructions to appear. I am uh, replacing Mr. Joshi in this matter, my lord. Yes. Serial number 55. 55. Yes. Joint request for some. Yes. <clears throat> joint request. We are on my question. Serial number 54. 54. 50. Yes. <laughs> With the consent. Whenever there is a consent of all the advocates appealing for the respondent or of the appellants, please give the chief to the learning court officer please. unless there is urgency on the part of the other side. <laughs> Agent, 54 agent. Please. Yeah, my question. Check. Call out the minister. 59 to 60. 60? 60, yes. No, please not receive baggage. Yeah. We have a location? Fine. 52 to 29. Sixty seven to seventy two. Seventy three to eighty one. Serial number seventy five. Seventy five. I'm mentioning on behalf of Mr. Christian Gavaria. Here I'm requesting for priority on his behalf. Here my lord sir directed this number. We'll take up at two thirty. Lord, 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 I may just mention uh, the responsible officers have remained present. I have a uh, coordinating uh, for uh, exemption of attendance of respondent number two. I have filed a PA to date. We it, don't know. We'll go by the order, Mr. Upadhyay. Yes, yes, my lord. I'm just requesting urgent circulation of the application. We can't give you urgent circulation to the Okay. Sure. Very good. Okay. Yes. Okay. yes. 79 and 80. Yes, where are you? Yes. Yes. Compliance order. We can keep it on Thursday and Fridays now since we have decided that all the matters of content will be taking up on Thursday and Friday. We can keep it on Then Monday. 24. Yes, 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 please wait. 83, you are not present. Mr. M. T. Mishra, learned advocate for Mr. U. T. Mishra, learned advocate states that with the order calling has been complied with. By depositing the amount with the labor court, it is urged that he is not desirous of pursuing the matter for the request is exhibited. The application is the contempt proceeding stands closed. Notice discharge. Application disposed of. Yes. Serial number eighty two. Two thirty. Ninety one to ninety six. Ninety seven. Ninety eight to hundred. Hundred and one to hundred and five. Hundred and six to Yes. This can be taken up according to me. This covered. Yes, covered. My yes. friend, 
That's the matter which was mentioned earlier also. Yes. 13 years of preparation now, husband has filed affidavit. Uh, agreeable for the divorce also. Divorce also. Please. 132 to 135. 133. 137 to 142. What is this 135 matter of Mr. Vijay Rao? Please take instructions. It might be that it is covered by some judgment of the yeah. yeah. Land acquisition matters, if they are covered by any of the judgment, then please bring it to the number. So please, yeah. Serial number 146. 146. Yes. yes. Uh, there is one civil application for disbursement. disbursement but today, Today, Mr. Nanavati is having some difficulty. Yes, yes uh, Miss Nanavati. The joint request, may I request it, but it can be kept on Thursday, 8 Wednesday. I'm grateful. Much of life, my Lord. Mentioning of the officer sheet. Yes. Uh, the connected matters are coming tomorrow. Only for, for the deposit of interest, there is some to be cut. Therefore, the other connected matters are coming tomorrow. Therefore, this to be requesting this to come tomorrow. Sixteen thousand. One fifty four. One fifty four. Your letter. I'm mentioning on behalf of Mr. Rahul. Uh, respondent number three and four are unserved. So I'm requesting for a fresh notice to be issued. Respondent number three and four are unserved. Yes. Miss Polo. Miss Sunjul, I'm an advocate for Mr. Rabin Rival. I'm an advocate for stage that respondent number three and four comma have remained unserved. Request is made for issuance of the fresh notice. Next paper. Issue fresh notice to respondent numbers three and four. Returnable on. Yes. Sir. Supplementary report. Supplementary report. Number twenty-four. Sir, just for now, wants to make a decision. Sir, requesting for two thirty as the additional affidavit desire was supposed to file as the honour at two thirty. Obliged. Sir, you keep it tomorrow. Ah, you know what? It will come at two thirty. Obliged. One matter board of separate board of one matter. This is that refund amount. What is it? Medical reimbursement. It is complied with. It is complied with. The reimbursement. Medical reimbursement. So what the panchayat is doing? They are waiting for. Yes. 
we want compliance. Right? We are not so concerned when we do the direction of October only to make a payment within the six weeks only. Therefore, you are only passing all this. Just a, we know that's why we. Okay. Mere writing letter is not sufficient. Mere writing letter is not sufficient. We want the compliance. 230. 230. Last Friday, he had been called by the office. I was saying that we are issuing the check. And he was asked to see the entire day. And we are just waiting that he... for the court to send an invitation at 230. Online pension. We went up, we want uh, positive uh, instructions, Mr. Not this writing letter and then expecting the panchayat to take Yes. Yes, Jamini. Do you have any request in the online mention? Yes, I have. I have mentioned. Yes. yes. One, one, six, eight, five, my lady. This is item number two. Uh, item number two. No. Yes. My yes. Lady, this is the matter where I am passing priority every time on the last yes. occasion due so to partner. It is not there on the board? No, my lord. It's it is adjunct to 29th, my lord. 29th of April. April? Yes, ma'am. Why this has been adjunct to 29th? You have been given in the shop. Oh, that's why I have. Anyway, we get it for the one of 16th. Yes. In the mention? Yes. That is also the staple. Yes. This could be because it runs to some property. But the case is that we are actually different details. There is a degree past the case, we have not talked to Our case is that the construction is going on. On a parcel of land which is sought to be kept basically, which is directed to be kept basically, yes. on which the construction is going on. That is how. Uh, the, the no, so this is for the pre-born member? Yeah, it is uh, pre-born member. Yes. Okay. So on uh, first day, plus, so the, first, since the construction is going on, if, uh, plus, uh, that 22nd. is how the time of life is going on. 22nd of the Yes. 37. There's a consent of the other side. Please give the chief after vacation. Very good. 37 after vacation. Yes. Serial number 10. I'm sorry, I missed out. Serial number 10. But there is a sick note of the other side. Any convenient date to your lot. 10, yes. Leave to appeal. Yes. But I have no urgency as such because this is pending since 18. <laughs> Very well. So, tell me the people on this side of the location when you come to the first of me. Yes. I requested circulation of Santam Manu tomorrow. The yeah. other group uh, of contents were not listed. Uh, Let it come in the due course. What, what happens? The matter pertains to the only set of 300 days. Day. But uh, earlier, some matters are uh, not copies of. As in when the matter comes, as in when we find that there is a non compliance. Group of uh, MCs are not kept tomorrow. Some group must be yeah. coming here tomorrow. Some group must be coming in the next week as well. So let it come in the due course. As I mentioned, it is held, it will be listed. Yes, Mr. Serum of one, you know. Serum of one. And Ludwig AGP mentioned, Lord, government is cleared. Lord, medical reimbursement is to be paid. Government is. Then I request for only wait. Thursday, I'll see that the payment is live. I am in receipt of a message today morning. Government has approved it on 9th. We have to pay around rupees one like fifty thousand. By this time, everything should have been. But nine was there were three four holidays in. So what? So we lot. So what? Mr. They are making you payment. You have to comply the order. You just no, can't stick to. Uh, no, no, the I don't say not. They have confirmed that they are paying the amount immediately. Yes. I request for eighteen morning. Even after eighteen morning. They were. Uh, uh, no, they cleared it on ninth. We issued information. Yes. Lord, there were holidays in between. This is what I am told. Tenth, eleventh. Holidays were not for. All. No, I don't. I don't offer any excuse, Lord, with yes. respect. But they say that if my lord would have taken a decision on 12th itself. Not 12th was only. Yes, 12th is not. No, it was not. But we, we received it on 10th. 12th, we not. Government passed order on 9th. I request yes. for tomorrow then. 
Yes, yes, tomorrow we want a compliance master. Yes, I'll talk to this matter we are not going to. Do. Yes, yes. Please don't compel the court to issue any further invitation not, to the we are, officers. We are, and we are depending upon the government's decision. Very well. They have okay. taken decision. Wherever you want to take a decision, you take a decision at the uh, expedition. Well, they have done it now. Yes. And I'll see that the payment is made. It is by tomorrow morning. Yes. I request for tomorrow. All right. Yes, whether you inform the others that we have, we'll, we'll just make a request at 2.30. We'll take up the matter yes. at 2.30 and then we'll decide. Lord, I will see that it is paid. 2.30, Mr. Yes. Muncha, let it be at 2.30. Yeah. Sure. <clears throat> Delay of 68 days. It's a matrimonial dispute. The ex parte order of divorce has been challenged before my laws. Yes. What is the explanation of that? In the works of uh, the lady, the uh, uh, present applicant is residing in the village of Maharashtra and she was never co communicated about it. After the lapse of time when the order was issued and it, uh, she is coming from a very uh, lower economic class, your lordships. And being so a lady, you stated that you are residing in some remote village of the Maharashtra, and you were not aware about uh, this, uh, or you were not informed. Uh, your lordship, sir. Yes, let us see where is that explanation. Your lordship, sir, in the cost title itself, it uh, no, shows. Not the cost title. We don't have to gather the explanation from the cost title. Your lordship, we have to see the evidence made in the application. Your lordship, sir. Please that I have it to the court. That is uh, the that is not uh, stated in their civil application. I would not. Uh, yes, sir, PJ. I may uh, put it on affidavit if yes, my lord. She learned that you get comma submitted that the applicant form is a resident of Maharashtra. Knowing to and was not aware about the nuances of the legal procedure to undertake to challenge the order passed by the learned family court. It is thereafter come. Advice was obtained, was taken. Papers were collected. And since she was short of funds, that a legal aid committee comma was approached. In the process, delay of 68 days from has caused in preferring the appeal. Ms. Joshila Nag Advocate Fund submitted. That the marriage has been resolved with her direction of permanent alimony of the history likes only to the wife, that is the applicant. And gross injustice come has been meted out. In para six, I have referred in para six of the application I have referred regarding that okay. she is coming from Maharaj. What you say is I'm, I'm Next, having considered the explanation of her, the condition, the situation of the applicant. In the time consumed, the Nubuna Friday comes. We are of the opinion that the delay comma deserves to be condoned at this stage. In the length of the delay. Grateful, man. Having regard to the submissions, the delay deserves to be condoned and is of the condom. Civil application subsidies and is according to the law. Now, let us first. Grateful, 
हिंदू मैरेज एक्ट एवरी पिटीशन वुड लाइव फर्स्टली लाइव बिफोर द डिस्ट्रिक्ट कोर्ट ही डायरेक्टली प्रिफर द एप्लीकेशन दिस इज जजमेंट एंड चैलेंज इन दर्स्ट अपील Yes, please. Right. I, yes, please. Notice has been issued by this court. Please. And during the pendency of the appeal, despite you having received the message, WhatsApp message, that the appeal is pending, you got remanded. Yes. Uh, my but submission is that yes. he uh, he uh, prefer an application, the yes. civil application under section fifteen one five. We'll consider your maintainability aspect as well. Only my submission two aspect that yes. se under section nineteen that uh, so uh, appeal is pending before this court. This is the question of section nineteen. You just show us. Please let us see. Hello, family. If my I I permitted to tender my reply. What uh, is this? Uh, in uh, I reproduce the section nineteen as well as section seven also. Yes. Page number fourteen. I reproduce the section nineteen. Yes. Court to which the petition shall presented. Every petition under this act shall be presented to the district court within the local limits whose ordinary civil jurisdiction. The marriage was a the, the first marriage was solemnized. The respondent at the time of presentation of the petition resides, or the parties to the marriage has last resided together, or the petition. Petitioner is residing at the time of presentation of petition in case where the respondent is at that time residing outside the territory of the which this act extended or has to be heard of being alive for a period of seven years or more by those person who is fully naturally have heard from him if he were alive and other and section seven. That subtle but the only marriage is they are producing the only marriage registration proof. Uh, certificate of the marriage registration they produce as a proof of marriage yes. but my contention is under section 7 the saptapadi fera yes. was required to be proved uh, to uh, prove the second marriage page number uh, 16 uh, section 7 also reproduce of the hindu marriage act section page number, number uh, 16 16 of my reply yes thank you what is this page number 16 you got page number 16 16 so what is your contention Uh, section seven. Yes. Uh, ceremony of the Hindu marriage act. A Hindu marriage may be solemnized in accordance with the customary rites. Ceremony of Please, either. Please, the beginning of uh, marriage is already been uh, dissolved. Please. Right. That order is under challenge. Please. Now there is an appeal filed. Please. So again, they have to file an application under section nineteen. Uh, under section fifteen, they have to uh, prefer. A uh, family suit before the family court. For what? Uh, uh, under section fifteen, to de declare by the the second marriage is null and void, and yes. they have to prove that second marriage was yes. performed by Saptapadi Fera. Yes. The this is the law says. Let us see. Let us see. Let us see. Please. Section fifteen. You say. Section fifteen. Please. Section fifteen. Uh, they have uh, reproduced in their yes. application. This civil application, page number three, section fifteen. When a marriage has been dissolved by the decree of divorce. Yes. And either there is a no right of appeal against the decree, or if there is such right of appeal, the time for appealing has expired without an appeal having been 
presented or an appeal has been presented but has been dismissed it shall be lawful for either party to marriage to marry again yes so let that us is see. the provision i so, cannot deny i am so, not denying so the provision the judgment the judgment is dated what please 25th of november 2023 it is what is it uh, limitation 60 days 90 days the, uh, the petition is filed filed within a period within of limitation limitation within period of limitation yes. there was no delay uh, in filing this uh, appeal yes. that from so how the section 19 was coming to picture Uh, section 19 because the, yes. he is the yes. they are seeking the relief under section 50 yes but section 15 already says that you can't remove if yes. within the limitation period if the appeal is already filed present it uh, page number 1 uh, you call in any of the categories file the affidavit with the registry of your for the application Only for my satisfaction, if my lord, let us me permit me to read the section seven. We'll keep it back. Let her. Who is for the applicant? Um, yes. D D P Malkan and R S Hatte. Yes, it is registered. The certificate has been issued of the marriage. Yes, yes. Where is the certificate of marriage? Please. Ah, uh, they have produced page number eight. Page number. Ah, uh, no. Page number ten. Page number ten. Page number eight is a. No, this is a form. Form. Where after? Page number nine. Marriage registration form. Where is the certificate? This is applied on eighth of March. Wait for some time. Let They have produced this. Uh, you have the certificate. I don't have. ठीक है सिंगल And do is before your access wrong. Step seven is also respondent number one. This is step seven. And his wife, I took it. There were various litigations between husband and wife. Yes. Husband expired blood. Yes. Wife was getting maintenance blood. Please. During the course of, we are not concerned with all those litigation. Straight come to the salary. Straight, if you come straight to the salary. Yes. I must say, Lord, that salary was executed in the year of two thousand nine. Yes. For property card, the Lord wife made an widow made an application. Yes. In two thousand ten. Yes. That is that is recorded in the judgment, Lord. Yes. And so it is recorded in two thousand fourteen, Lord. Mm -hmm. On the humble request, is that the law would not get anything, Lord, if there is a notice. Whatever is legally permissible, you will get this. Yes. If notice would be issued, Lord, this is a family dispute, and she may get something. Otherwise, the law would not get anything. Mm -hmm. The fact Whatever is, whatever is permissible in law. Will this is a humble request to the lawyers because otherwise your lawyers and I must be fair with the lawyers. Even your lawyers knows that that said it is two thousand nine. It is on page number seven.
My more thing is not. If Suti expressly barred my limitation, then please. It was not barred. And please to be clear. It is that. At the same time, there are judgments. The limitation is a mixed question of law and facts. Mm -hmm. And it is to be tried. It is your own suit. Yes. It is to be it is your decided own. in the yes. trial. Yes. So that the ground law. Yeah, there are judgments on this side and that side. So what are the judgments which applies you? Let us not go on the judgments. Okay. Supreme Court has already said time and again. The judgments are not to be read as a useless theory. Circumstantial flexibility. She is seeing yes. the video on the order. If it appeals to your answers, I can make a humble request to your answers. Fact is this I cannot run away from it. Mm -hmm. Something can be lost. She, she may get some panning law to maintain herself. But this is not a suit of maintenance. Your is right, but you they are brought here. Lord, these you, are you have taken out all the litigation. If at all you feel, then you should have at least requested your stepson and the, and the, all the family members of your husband. She yes. is... On one hand, you keep on filing everything. Maintenance, domestic violence also. There are not many litigations. Then, you know, it's a matter of record. I cannot... And I want to see that. With them. I want to see that if any litigation. How many years you stayed with uh, the, the with your husband? The, the, when did you uh, marry? Except, uh, I'm not getting the date. Not I had, whatever that ceremony which was undertaken. For that a, was in the year. Uh, I may try to point that out to your sister. Please. How many years? For how many oh, oh. years you stayed with uh, your husband? Not the suit is filed in 2007. Not the suit. No, for a moment. No. Yeah, that HMP was, was filed. HMP was filed in 2006. Yes, 2006. 2007. HMP was filed. Uh, in 2006, an and and advertisement was, was given uh, in 2006 for marriage. Yes. That is right. In 2007, the divorce. She was not in this affair. Kept on filing the suits and applications. But the, I don't have much personal knowledge about the disputes. You are representing the applicant. How no, you can say that you are not aware about who you are no, supposed to take no, this? It, it is yes. a record speaks without that there were litigations. Yeah. There were litigations, record speaks. A record is there. There were a lot many litigations. Mm -hmm. but I don't know much about their personal relations, you know, but any of what I say is this. You know, after all, she is the mother of she can be a staff mother. It is Mr. all our small request. Yes. Only one line. Mm -hmm. If at all any litigation is pending even against the son, you know, domestic violence or anything. But these can be brought to an end in you know, one stop, you not know, before this one. In mediation. It can be referred to mediation. They can be called here. These are family disputes, you know, it can be brought to an end. That's the only request. The humble request to your officers. Yes. It was never the idea behind the issuance of the notice or the public uh, this what was that notice. Your no, Lordship may clarify that this notice is being issued for mediation purpose. That can be done. Normally, you know, family matters court is you not know, slow in deciding on marriage. You know. This and is not a family dispute. This is only you are challenging the sale date which was executed so, no. in the year 2009, which you were very well aware. And you filed a suit only in the year 2015. 
and the court has but she right must not have been advised by limitation no, 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 yes you destroy the findings given by the learned judge she must not have been advised properly not that is not an exception carved out in article 59 of the limitation act that if the prop, if the party is not properly advised then that time is to be given a set off no that that is the fact. Yes. that's a request i can make to the if it can be considered Woman That's why the court was asking you, Mister, for how many time you stayed with the husband. Therefore, I'm saying. What was the duration? It seems in 2007 she initiated uh, the litigation, and 2006. And in 2006 you got married, full heart. Seems. And 2007 litigation started. How you expect them to show any compassion? After all, she is not a lady, not a widow, not old as a lonely lady. Some mercy can be shown. Yes. That's the only request. Yes. That is all. Right. At least, I am a customer. Yes. Would you have not, she not called for the record? Normally, we not appeal. Appeal. We can dismiss it at the stage of admission without calling for the recording proceedings. Because we are very much. This satisfied. is a humble request to yes. see that somehow in mediation it can be resolved. I don't want to prolong is, the litigation. Is, this but, is not a family dispute in stricto sensu, husband wife's dispute. This is a challenge to the sale deed, which has been rejected. Lord, I cannot stretch it further. Lord, I can't take much time of the process. Yes. But a humble request, if it can be considered. Sympathies are with you, but we are also bound. This is for sympathy yes. only, Lord. I think yes. that's time. Yes. You have other litigations pending. Other litigations are there. No, six. Maintenance, divorce, divorce, perhaps now won't survive. So you are in, Lord, in some. Some litigation pending litigation, yes. it was observed yes. that this sanded is not in order. Yes. It seems to have been done Lord, with malice intention. Sanded has been done with malice intention to see that she may not get any. Very well, but then the remedy was available. Because she would be nowhere. Yes. You look at her age. Yes. Anything else? 74 years old. Anything else, Mr. Good business. I don't Mr. By this application, the applicant, the appellant, has sought to challenge the judgment dated. 7th of March, passed by the London 22nd edition of Senior Civil Judge Vadodra in Special Civil Judge number 179-2003, whereby come the suit filed by the appellate has been rejected. On the ground, that the same form is barred by the limitation. It having filed beyond the period of two years, <clears throat> Mr. Manish Parsa, you appear for me. Yes, for that. Mr. Manish Parsa, learned advocate for Mr. Guy Pritin, yes, learned advocate for the appellant form, submitted. That maybe the small I am required to be for another report. Maybe because my colleague would be here. Yes. Not sure. submitted. That the appellant form is 72 years old. I live. widow, mm -hmm. and therefore, mm -hmm. Considering the age and the status count, 
the appeal comma be considered at the admission stage. It is urged that if the content comma is called upon, it might happen that some way comma can be found out. It is submitted that the present appeal form is a mercy appeal, considering the age, the status, and the dispute involved. Next time, it is submitted that the submitted the, the appeal form, the sale date, which was executed. The sale which was executed in the year 2010 was with a malafide intention and not the genuine. It is therefore urged that the applicant deserves consideration and this court come deserves consideration. First of heard Mr. Mishka, heard the learned appearing for appellate at the outset, it is required to be noted that Mr. Pausa, that Mr. Mahesh Pausa, learned advocate one, has fairly considered before this court that there is that the appeal form that the suit form was filed. Next, I has finally considered that the present appeal form has been filed only with a view to seeing that some way com is found out and the wife who is a stepmother of the respondent's com gets something out of the property. It is not the, it is not denied. It is also fairly admitted that the marriage box solemnized of the apple with the in the year 2006. However, it did not, it did not work and immediately <laughs> HMP suit number 540 2007 from hours 5 It is next week. Mr. Manish Pausa, learned advocate, could not point out any error from the judgment as to how come the learned judge come and any error from the judgment. At this stage, come in the next week, continuing to come the suit has been filed by the suit was filed by the apple against the defendants against the responding by issue regional defendants seeking to challenge the sale deal. they did
register sale date. Date. The sale date twenty third of October two thousand nine. Registered on twenty second of January two thousand ten. <coughs> Where is? How it starts? Second to January. <clears throat> Sale the date is so and registered on so and so so and so. It is also not in dispute that the suit form that the claim form and the cause of action form it has been stated that the that it has a reason on twenty eighth of March two thousand fifteen. Considering the <clears throat> the learning judge, when considering the provisions of Article Fifteen and the limitation provided there, in the aspect of Limitation running from was of the opinion that the suit form ought to have been filed within a period of three years. However, from the same form has been filed beyond three years. <clears throat> Next one the defendants, the respondent dash defendants form. I prefer an application, order 7 really level, seeking rejection of the privilege. Inter area on the ground of limitation. The learning judgment. While considering the provisions of order 7 really level, as noted, that while, the, while deciding the application, the print com is required to be considered together with the documents. The language is com in the print. And more particularly from in para six form in vernacular and free English translation where of form is to the effect that the respondent taking the advantage of the disputes between the plaintiff and the deceased Dilipesha. And only with a view to grab the property from got the registered sale date, dated 23rd of October 2009, executed and was registered on 22nd of January 2010. Considering the say arguments made in para 6 about the knowledge. And the aspect of cause of action stated in the plaint com to be of 2015 com. The learned judge com referred to the judgment of the apex court in the case of Bachelor by Javed by Patel versus Josh by Siva by Patel. Reported in 2013 into bracket 1 GLR page 3 where in comment has been moved and observed that that whenever the document is registered, the date of registration becomes the 
date of deemed knowledge. And in, a, in, in the other cases where a fact could be discovered by due diligence, then deemed knowledge would be attributed to the plaintiff because a party cannot be allowed to extend the period of limitation by claiming that he had no knowledge. The learned judge next by the learned judge come. Therefore, comma considering the said judgment was of the opinion that the date on which the document was registered is considered to be a deemed date of knowledge. The learned judge come was also of the opinion that the sale which is a subject matter of chairman, was registered with the office of the sub registrar on 22nd of January 2010, whereas the suit comma has been filed on 1st of May 2015. Considering the provisions of Article 59, the learned, which of uh, 59, which provides the limitation of three years from the fact became known to him to find that the suit common is beyond is filed beyond limitation. The suit ought to have been filed within a period of three years. However, comma it is filed beyond three years and therefore comma would be barred by limitation. The learning just comma <coughs> Considering the other various judgments of the of this court as well as of the High Court or the Supreme Court found rejected the plaint, accepting the application order seven may be left. Next day, Mr. House or Learning Advocate could not point out any error much less any perversity in the judgment of the learning. Judgment, the interim judgment. And therefore, come this, this quote from is of the considered opinion that the appeal from the results to be dismissed at the admission stage in absence of any illegality or material irregularity or perversity being pointed out by the learned judge, by the learned advocate, except stating that the that if the notice is issued, the applicant, appellant being a widow, aged 74 years from, may receive some may receive some benefit. Next one. We are this time this court form is of the considered open that the judgment form having passed. The judgment comma is legal and no error has been committed by the learning judge in accepting the evidence made in the plate and the fact that the suit form has been filed beyond the period of limitation. We, the appeal of the results to be dismissed and we see how it is dismissed. In view of the dismissal of the appeal form, civil application for suit does not survive and is ever dismissed. Yes, it's page 28. Yes. When the petitioner was serving as laboratory technician, yes. thereafter he was to be granted higher pay scale. Much of the dispute was with in the main SCM, is the dispute with, with regards to the date, my yes. as to which date is to be considered while granting him higher pay scale. My yes. The direction granted by this honorable court are at page 28, my yes. para yes. 8. So, 3rd of July 2023. 
please my dear uh, monetary benefits were directed to be paid within a period of 3 months from the date of the order please my dear anything any uh, like uh, well they have made one request by them no my lord still they have not paid anything they have not paid anything then we have made a representation as well ji rahul then credit while pointing out the order while pointing out the cav judgment dated 3rd of july 23 submitted then in para h didan net single judge hai para h while allowing the late petition form as directed the respondent authorities to extend the benefit due to the petition within a period of 3 months from the date of the cav judgment this type passage of 9 months no steps have been taken in the order form and remain and not in complete and said the submission is in office with the respondents principal department in the office to the respondent we going to allow we can talk to please talk to डायरेक्शन in view of the above the order terminating the services of the petitioner stated is hereby caused the order of the termination shall not operate and the petitioner shall be treated to have been continuous service from the date of his appointment he has been reinstated in his in his services but is uh, continuous service not given where is that so it has been stated in the legal notice no not in the legal notice on what basis you say that they have not complied with this direction of the government so we have made uh, the representations to that extent of the portion of the order as uh, they have been stated as back in the year 2022 when the order was passed but after that they have not recorded in the service book that this order was passed so and the service is that? service book that i have to close when they have not recorded that they will extend you the that uh, that is also mentioned in the legal notice also we yeah. need to not in the legal notice we need to see from the conduct of the respondents not you may say anything there is no yes. such direction so you yeah. uh, as per the order shall not operate at the petitioner shall be treated to have been in continuous service from the date of the appointment the continuous so service part is not shall not be treated as a break So it what is, is the document is, to suggest that this period from 11th of August 2020 to 20th of September 2020 has been treated as a break, or they have not been extended the benefit of continuous service? So I have only the legal notice at hand right now. The all legal notice is immaterial. Then may I request for next week we will produce the service books, Miss uh, Kira Nudasi, so Miss Niyati Chauhan, Miss Nudasi. We'll say that Miss uh, Kira Nudasi for Miss Niyati Chauhan, no, Miss Chauhan's name only. Then please, Mr. Dupa. And may I request for next week on Miss Niyati Chauhan, learned advocate with Miss Kiran Nudasi, learned advocate for the applicant form. The request for some time, so as to place it on the record. Next week, in support of her allegation that the order has not been complied with, and the petitioner has not been treated. The service of the petitioner has not been treated as a continuous service. Is the matter on twenty minutes? Please, Your Honour. Salam, Sir. Sir, you have been told. Yes. My last week was seen. Page number fourteen, my Lord. Yes. पेज नंबर फोर्टीन पैराग्राफ नंबर फाइव 
merit means having heard the learned advocates appearing for respective parties and considering the opposite undisputed facts and circumstances, we are of the opinion that the impu notification by which the land of the petitioners out of the land getting survey number 457 is sought to be acquired for straight line for Kudas and Road cannot be sustained. And the same is nothing but a colorable exercise of power and most arbitrary and only with a view to favor one person that is Varava by Parmar. It is not in dispute that earlier the land acquisition proceeding to acquire the land needed for straight line for Kudas and Road was completed under which some portion of the land of opposite Varava by was also acquired along with other persons. The land acquisition proceedings were already concluded. Even Section 11 award what was also the date of the order? What is the date of the order? It is uh, 1st September 2016. 2016? Yes. 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 Thereafter, may I read further? Please. Yes, even section 11 award was also uh, even section 11 award was also declared at the instant of opposite Varava by another even the land reference was made to the district court to enhance the amount of compensation and even the amount of compensation was enhanced, which was further carried to this court by way of first appeal and even the said first appeal came to be disposed of by awarding additional interest despite the about and after period of approximately 10 to 15 years and despite the fact that earlier all efforts to change the alignment were rejected the impute notification has been issued for realignment of the straight line Fort Kudasan Road, which cannot be sustained. It is required to be noted that even as per the earlier order, that is a change in the alignment of straight line Fort Kudasan Road. And if realignment is permitted as suggested, now instead of straight line road, there shall be a curve and not only that, but the length of the road is likely to be increased by 15 meter, which shall not be in the larger public interest. It is always advisable that there is a straight line road other than the road having curve, other under the circumstances also, the impugn notification and action of the respondent in realignment change in the alignment of straight line for Kudasan Road cannot be sustained and the same deserve to be cautioned set aside. In view of the above and for the reasons stated above, present special civil application succeed. Impugn notification number so-and-so dated so-and-so issued under section 4.6 of the Land Acquisition Act 1894 by which the land of the petitioner out of the land bearing survey number 457 at measuring so-and-so is sought to be acquired are hereby caution set aside and the action of the respondent in realignment change in the alignment of straight line for Kudas and Road is hereby caution set aside. The respondents are hereby permanently restrained from taking the position of the land of the petitioner out of the land bearing survey number so and so meter pursuant to the impugn notification which as such are caution set aside rule is made absolute to the opposite extent in the facts and circumstances of the case there, is, there shall be no order as to for cost. Now, yes. thereafter, the uh, acquisition proceeding, the acquisition authority is required to free our land from the acquisition proceedings in the revenue record. For that, they have not initiated any proceeding, my lord. Where is that direction? For that, the direction, the particular direction is not required, my lord. So, the the where land is which, Where is the non compliance? Non compliance. Which is, direction? Of, the land acquisition proceedings were set as, uh, caution set aside. Yes. Section 4 and section 6 was caution set aside yes. for the permanent permanently. Yes. Now the in the revenue record, the effect was same was already there. So for removing the said effect, the acquisition authority is required to initiate Where the action. Where is that direction? But, but that is not required to be uh, mentioned in the order itself. That Where? that has to be done after so the land there acquisition. Is a direction in the order. You are seeking non-compliance of the direction of the High Court. Thereafter, we have so made has to be specific there have, direction. Thereafter, we have made applications to the effect that kindly do the needful so that our land may be free yeah, from the have, acquisition. Have they, have they continued with the acquisition after this? No, my lord. Then, but they have not freed our land yeah, from the same acquisition. steps you have to take there. Then but we have already we have already yeah, given yes. the application, but you they are not. Show, you only show us that. The state government or the acquisition or the inquiring body hmm. has taken further steps in furtherance of section four and six of the land acquisition. That realignment or the alignment has been effected by the authorities. But the effect of have they taken any steps? No, no, my no. But the effect of this order yes. is required to be given. It you show me to the lal that there was a direction that since section four and section no, they have the not done anything with regard to taking ag again the uh, uh, acquisition proceeding. They have not initiated against. Then the there land. is a question of non-compliance. But, but 
till then what if what is just remember and keep in mind keep in mind that you are in the contempt jurisdiction please you have to see that what is the direction issued by the court and where is the non compliance if you feel the section 4 notification or section 6 notification or section 11 award or section 18 steps have been taken by the state government then we are with you but if there is nothing in furtherance of section 4 and section 6 notification if further consequential steps are to be taken it is to be for it is to be taken by you and that is no non compliance but that we have that is that is what i am requesting so if they are not taking any steps you have the remedy available we are not here to address okay. but not in the contempt of court but the effect of this order is required to be given by the authority that is we are only concerned with the non compliance not the effect of the order effect of the order you have to take the necessary steps in strictly in accordance with law maybe under the glrc code or maybe under the tenancy tenancy and hardly would come into picture it has to be glrc in 2016 order there is something like limitation in the act this year limitation is this is a continuous uh, how, how it is a continuous because they are not free our land that will always be there But you need to show first that they have taken steps under Section Four and Section Six. That that, that is not that direction. That that, that is not that man. Non-compliance of any direction. So the effect of this order, how it is recorded? Because that in spite get, of that giving so many applications, you have to go to yourself and then to answer. You will get the answer. In spite of giving so many applications since 2016, they are not uh, taking you any. You know us that they have acted uh, in the pants of this direction in para six, and they have acquired the land as per section four notification that, or section six. That is not that. That I am I myself yes. submitted, but that is not that. The but notification has been. What I request, my lord, should they at least reissue the notification? Now? What I am requesting, my lord, should that my lord should may give at least the oral instruction that at least because in, unless and until they will initiate uh, any action with regard to the effect of giving this order, nothing is going to because it is not in our hand that we can the approach the revenue order. The authority. position of the land is with them. The position of the land is with them. With us, but we cannot with, with us. With you only. Yes, but the Have further transaction cannot be given. Okay, further transaction. If I wanted to sell the land or something, you need to approach the revenue authority. You are because only a one in one uh, direction from my lordship. This is not well, for that uh, direction <laughs> issuance of the direction. Mr. Sony is a seasoned lawyer. He knows very well. Please, my lord. May your lordship. May may make a submission, sir. She is already making a submission. That's only. I'm just yes. replying the query of the. So the thing is that for me the order was already passed. The land acquisition was Contemporary already portion set aside. Section is not meant for inaction on the part of the respondent. Unless and until. Unless there is a specific direction issued and they have not complied with. What I am submitting to my lordship that yes. the order is already passed. Yes. Land acquisition co- co- proceeding all, is already portion is set aside. Yes. So this is something which is if it is not even directed, it is required to be done by you the land to, to complete the effect to to complete the effect of this order. That Otherwise, this the, order will. That is not the idea of the contempt jurisdiction. It's very simple that there has to be a direction issued by the court and non-compliance on the part of the state government. Just them. because they are con, they you have not been you are not in a position to undertake the consequential action or the steps. State government is not to be blamed, or the authorities are not to be blamed. Neither the accusation. Right. Now they have to do the process. That is the purpose. They have yeah. They have removed our land. Uh, okay. On the basis of the land acquisition or proceedings. Yes. Now at least they have to re-enter because some of the they have. To, The, it is re- our re-enter a, our name in the record. The steps you have to take. You have the order in your hand. You have the proceedings of the government. Then now they have surrendered you the land. So you have to take the steps, approach the mamlata for mutation of the entry in your favor. Is there any entry mutated? Please, please my lordship. Then my lordship may pass the order. Is we are not view, going to pass any order. Only with a view to approach the concern you, authority. A, miss, miss, please, please, my. Lord. Even if we dispose of the uh, uh, this uh, contempt application, it is available to you. 
Please, then with a view to approach the concern, concern authority, I am withdrawing. Let me will also. Let me also. Yes, please, please. No. Hey, will we only say Miss Maria Dalal, learned advocate, appearing with Mr. Yatin Sohi, learned advocate, seeks permission to withdraw the caption application with a liberty to approach the uh, appropriate authority for taking necessary for steps. Action. Yes. In your order passed by High Court. That we are not going to say. Request is exceeded to application is disposed of as a withdrawal with your Please, Mike. Highly. After filing of this uh, application, yes. some developments have happened. I filed an additional I have an additional record. Yes, what is this? Please. Uh, the first matter which happened, which happened in SCA 817 2 of 2009. Yes. Yes, let us see what is the direction issued by the court. And non page number 10 is the imprint order. Page number 10 is the imprint order. Yes, direction. Yes. There are various affidavits filed between both the Direction parties. issued yes. by the court. In view, paragraph number five, in view of the learned advocates for the respective parties jointly submitted, this, this petition will dispose of in the terms of the above mentioned paras as the grievance of the petition is now set aside, page number 13. Yes. Accordingly, present petition disposed of. It will be open for the petition to approve the concern of the necessary permission paper sub pursuant to the subject matter. Yes. Yes. Then what happens? Yes. After this, we have approached the uh, uh, Vadodara Municipal Corporation for yes. allotment of the land, which was taken up in the Panchnama. The Panchnama was drawn while the pen, while the hearing of the main petition, which is SC 8127 to 2019. A Panchnama was drawn and affidavit was filed. There are various affidavits which I have also annexed in copies of affidavit from 14 to 40 feet. An allotment and uh, money marcation of the land was given for the Hawking zone of the petitioner. After this, after the FI, after the relevant Where portion the direction, of Miss Patel, what is the direction to the authorities? Only Let's the look. affidavits have been observed in the entire in the thing. Where is the direction? Some affidavit was placed on record. You have jointly submitted that the matter can be disposed of. The court has disposed of. Where is an undertaking given to the court? Or where is an affidavit filed before the court? Please, may I read that please. page paragraph number six to nine. It's starting yes, from page eleven. Read it. By the way, of addition, I the corporation para 629 stated is under. During the course of hearing on 12 10 2022, the petitioner paid for identification piece allotted to him by the corporation. The honorable could directed the corporate to identify and earmark the spot which has been allotted to him by the corporation. I say the petitioner was called by the corporation the side and shown the exact place which has been allotted to him. For case either of identification, the said area has been demarked by making marking on the ground. Photograph of identification place made by corporation present petitioner are next year with and marks marks the selection RR1. Pashram has also been drawn present petition, clearly mentioning their exact space in the earmark and made known to the petitioner by the corporation. The signature of the petition being obtained on Panchnama, acknowledging the correctness of the contents of the Panchnama. A copy of Panchnama being uh, bearing signature petition next year with an master and lecture R2. I state that construction of flyover and other infrastructure development work is being carried out by different agencies in other space allotted to present uh, uh, to the petitioner with the corporation. As a result of such work activities, it may not be possible for the petitioner to direct access to the allocated spot and freely occupy the use set spot of the land. In fact, large extent of surrounding barricades so as to prevent any person accessing such area where construction and other activities have been carried out with the view to prevent accident and injury. The fact is known to the petitioner is made aware by the corporate that he may or not be able to put up a cabin or even a moving cart. Yes. That so what the... happened after this? After this order, we approached the Vadodara Municipal Corporation yes, for have... giving us the allotment letter. Mm -hmm. However, back and forth, we have gone, they have not uh, run. After issues of contempt notice, they gave us an allotment letter. Yes. Yes. However, the allotment letter says that rupees 300 agreement has to be done in pursuance of this order. Still now, we have filed various, even uh, latest notice has been issued to them. The, they are not providing us any agreement or anything to go ahead with this in pursuance of this order. Now there is a contempt. Because in this order, when the matter was yes. ar argued, yes. it is... When it has been grievance based, yes. according it will then be open to the petition. A, a new cause of action available to you, not the, the contempt jurisdiction. Because in pursuance of this order for allocation, yes, but then we are on a very simple. Please, you show us the direction which was issued by the court and has not been complied with. Affidavit has been filed. 
it has been agreed before the court that you are a similarly situated person and you will be allotted a plot of nine square meters. Yes. Right? You have to follow the procedure. If there is some impediment in following the procedure, if they are not doing it, then there is a separate cause of action available to the non compliance. Yes, fellow. In this matter, yes. the SC 817 to 2019, yes. this, it was also filed in pursuance of an order of SCA 421 to 2016. So yes. this matter, the allotment is going we, on since 2016. We are not concerned with the earlier proceeding or the connected proceeding. We are only concerned with the direction. We don't find any direction in the order. Because even this order to fulfill this order, uh, to get the place, are you... We are not sitting, we are not going to sit in the... Rather, we are not going to identify the decision of the corporation, whether they are right in, they are right as, as, uh, asking you to provide the agreement, not to provide the agreement. For that, after if you want the allotment of nine square meters, you have to follow the procedure. Again. I have, it has to be there. I have. That yes. is why I took for my... Then you go and approach the authorities. And if at all, there is an inaction. There is this additional effort of it after, the, after this filing. This has come across. Mm -hmm. What is this? There is this Kabja Pauti, which was given mm -hmm. on 21 9, 2023. Yes, that is given by the corporation. Yes, 888. Uh, yes. However, they still keep on, there is this 300 rupees, the stub, which is at page number 89. After the contempt notice and after filing this petition, a kabja pauti was given by them in pursuance of this order. Yes. However, to fulfill that kabja pauti or take their possession, an agreement needs to be made between both the parties, the corporation as well as this thing in pursuance of the affidavit which was filed by them before this court. Yes. So they have they are fulfilling, but they're instead of Abjapati, they are not letting me. I cannot operate just to I cannot put a cabin over there without an agreement between both the parties. And that agreement is also given. They have given you the possession receipt. The corporation has given you the possession receipt of 21st of September 2023. Page they 80, have also earmarked the uh, page 89. Have, if my lord is page 89. I did the upper janavan kudna 21st September 23 Naroj Padon And if before that, Mr. H. S. Pardeshi. In this very much, before the year mark, there is a passage again, but I get the milk 399 20 to 24 17 7 2000. And now the part of Patra, which is there, which is behind it. Yes. 17, 7, 2008, at page number 89. Yes. Which clearly says, and the second paragraph, Sadar Jagyan Yatri officer Sarvi Dimarkesh Kari Apetim Mujo Abne Chalis Sarvi Jagyan Sarva Kachi Cabin Banavi Mukwan Reshet. They made Novin Parvan Jagyan Halno Parvadam Doran Parvana Fi Prati Mas Parpai Karvani Reshet. Novin Family Jagyan at a trade Haral Namuna Mujani Kararupia, Tronson of the Stavi stamp paper, Din Tisma for Kari Apano Reshet. Yes. After that, I have again approached, uh, a notice has been sent to them to provide us, which is at page number A91. Yes. Till they they have not complied. But then, what is the direction? They have taken steps in furtherance of the government's uh, made in parasites of their affidavit. Yes. If something new has come up, then not the content jurisdiction. Yes. May I just take instructions? Please take instructions. After two matters. After. At 230. 230. Hmm. Hurry. Yes. Not complying to order. You are not single church. You are not sick. Page number 36. <coughs> Within a period of three months from the date of the receipt of the order, 10th of November 2023. 23. What is the date of the receipt? Date of the receipt, the date number. <coughs> Which date they have been served upon? 32A, page number. Page number? 32A. 32A, Miss. Miss. Miss Alka Patel. Miss Alka Patel. Yes. Mr. Kapati learned that he from Mr. Kirti Deva Dalit. Learned that he from Mr. Kirti The order was passed on 10th of November 22, directing the respondent to extend the benefit of 300 days privileged with, <coughs> with the areas. 
preferably within a period of three months from the date of the receipt of the copy. The copy comment has been served upon the respondents immediately thereafter. That is somewhere in the month of first week of somewhere in the first week of December 2023. Till date, comma, no steps have been taken. Consider the submission issue notice to the respondents returnable on 18th of June. Yes. Page number eight is the first order, and operative portion is on page number ten. Yes. Para three. Page number. Page ten. One G. Page ten. Yes. Para three. Yes. On the other hand, Mr. Swan so learned UDP appearing for the respondent state under instruction would state that. Two oversight and one of its mistake, the land belonging to petitioners who had acquired the proceedings could not be completed. Yes. They would submit that the mistake shall be corrected after following due procedure, mm -hmm. including so declaration of power within six months. application, what was that extension granted? Yes, uh, yeah. this yeah. this order was not complied with. Therefore, was they came with to comply with the order up to thirty first of Lord, what it happened thereafter? Nothing has happened. Yes, who appears? Date, no Please the papers and instructions as well. Yes. We keep it, um, Ms. Deepa Patel and I did comment, submitted that the order was passed, directing the respondent to, <clears throat> to complete the acquisition proceedings, uh, preferably within a period of six months from the date of the order, and to declare the award on August 15th of September 2023. Since the same was, same could not be done, an application seeking extension of time was referred. And with the order dated 8th of December 2023, the time was extended up to 31st of March 2024. Within the extended period, also, comma, the award has not been declared. Not. Mr. Nida Sharma, learned assistant government leader, comma, to take steps uh, to, to take instructions. This is the matter on 22nd of this 22nd of April. Please. Please take instructions. Oblige. Yes, yes. What is this matter? Why you have got it today? For condonation of the There are somebody requesting. Look, I, I just in yes. I'm narrated the set short facts, my lord. No, let us see what, what do you want. Uh, yes, that's why I'm just saying. Yes. Only one minute, my lord. That these all first appeal originally arising out of the land acquisition. Yes. They are already already admitted. Yes. Now, during the pendency of this matter, when when it was notified for the final hearing, when we have called our clients, they have informed us that some of the clients are expired. Yes. So we have filed application for bringing legal ads yes. and also for setting aside the abatement on yes. this one thing. Yes. And in both the matters, there is a delay. Therefore, I have also filed application for condoms of delay in bringing legal heirs as well as for setting aside that. These are the four. And one, one more application is for the amendment. We are claiming, enhancing the claim amount. In all matters, we are enhancing the claim amount. Initially, under section 11, 12 rupees was awarded. Thereafter, my lord, in section 18. Many first appeals are there? seven. Seven first appeals. Seven first appeals. There are six. In all the seven first appeals there is there are civil applications for uh, enhancement yes no enhancement we will consider later on yes let us see first what are the civil applications seeking condonation of delay yes ma'am in first matter yes in effort 259 of 2000 yes there is a my lord yes. I, I just i am just in second matter there is no deal uh, no bringing legal ass and there are okay, out of two six zero and two six two. There are no and two six four. So there are no. There are only one application for amendment. So which are those first appeals wherein there are civil applications seeking condonation of delay as? Uh, yes, two fifty nine, two fifty nine, two sixty one, and two sixty three. 259, 259, 261, 
and 263. In all three matters. And the third one was? Two, uh, 259, 261, and 263. In these three matters, the, there are civil applications for, for bringing legal acts, acts and for setting aside the abatement. Aside the along with the delay condone application. Delay condone. Yes. Right. So your delay condonation application is in the abatement or in the bringing acts? For bringing acts. For bringing legal acts only and for okay. setting aside that. Okay. Not first appeal. First appeal was already admitted. Okay. So let us see first the application. Now. Yes, ma'am. Uh, so first appeal number 259. Yes, 259. Aside for a time being, the amendment application. Uh, where is this? Uh... Hello, amendment application. Hello. So two civil application for condonation of delay. One in for S and one for setting aside. Yes, my lord. So first we are supposed to take what? Civil application for uh, uh, I, 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 It's Only one thing. If they are objecting for... Uh, for yes. bringing ads and then that can be otherwise followed. That can be allowed, yes. For bringing ads. Applications to... We have no objection. Okay. What is the delay? Let us for see. Amendment, Malu. Just 259, where are the civil applications? No, I, I just pointing out the amendment application now. Amendment we will consider later on. First, we only... Uh, yes. Dispose of, we will we'll consider the civil applications. Yes, ma'am. Very much obliged. What are the civil application, Mr. Lettuce, in this application? who was to object the present application otherwise this would have been considered by the registrar judicial we can understand what as per the rules what are the major which are the categories of the civil application to be decided by the registrar judicial if there is no objection by the other side Why? You said you have no objection. So, but there is an amendment. The objection was in the amendment, not in the civil application seeking condonation of the amendment. He opposed. Yeah. Amendment, we are not saying. We are not deciding. We are not touching the amendment. If you have any objection, you may file your reply, whatever you want to do. But so far, the civil application seeking condonation of delay in the legal heirs and the abatement, we are only going to consider. Let us see. Whether this matter can be placed before the registrar? No, it was earlier uh, placed before the registrar, if I mistake not, Malo. Yes, and there, Malo, then the uh, concerned officer of the respondent, Malo, they said that it has to be referred to the this bench, Malo. But so there are, is, who are they to decide? It? Let us that, see. Malo, they they are, perhaps it was to be decided on merits, Malo. No, but that will be only an amendment application, not the civil application for condonation of delay. Right. Yes. <laughs>
Yes. Yes. How much is the delay? Yes, madam. In 259. Yes. For bringing legal errors, 464 days. How much? 464 days. 464. Ah, and for abatement for 404. 404. Then 261. Just a minute. 259. 259, 464 for bringing legal ass and 404 for, for setting aside the abatement. trying to find out the papers of the civil application for the 464 is in? 464 in bringing legal ass. Bringing legal ass. Yes. Yes. And, and for setting aside the abatement, 404. 404. Where is the application for setting aside the other thing? See it? is for legal errors. One is four sixty four days. We don't have the papers of four of right? I find. Yes, we have. We have four zero four and four sixty four. Mm. 
Yes. Yes, Mister. In uh, all the matters, it is the same. No, also different, there? different. Different. In third matter, uh, yeah. In just a minute. Just a minute. Yes. Mm -hmm. In second matter. Just a minute. Just a minute. Yes, yes, Mr. You are there, you must be there. You are here by this application. First, you take it, the abatement. By this application, the appeal from form has paid for. On the delay of 404 days caused in preparing the caption application, seeking setting aside the abatement. Trade appellant number one, Mr. Yatin Sun, the need advocate form, has made his submissions along the lines of the evidence made in the application. It has been said, it has been never, I just submitted that. That during the hearing of the appeal, when the appellant comma were con appellants comma were contacted to remain present, it was informed that the appellant comma has passed on. It is thereafter that the steps were taken. for bringing the years in the record. And also a request to provide the details of the demise of the FLM in the, in the process that occurred a delay. And the appeal come was abated. It deserves that delay be condemned. The delay being a journey the same form of the country. Mr. Neera Sharma, the assistant government leader, is submitting that considering the length of delay from and the explanation of our form, the same form be not pending. However, the former request is made for passing the appropriate items. Having regard to the evidence, so also the other submission, the present application deserves to be allowed and is accordingly allowed. Okay, we should be Mr. Nishan's new service of notice of the one we have of the respondents. Deserves to be allowed and is accordingly allowed. No reason of absolute civil application. In the region, civil application. Succeed and is accordingly allowed. The delay is pending. The delay of the delay caused in preparing the application comment is pending. No is not absolute. No other is request. Civil application for setting aside the abatement. What is the civil application for setting aside the abatement? <coughs> By this application, the applicant can be paid for setting a self abatement with the applicant number one. It is submitted. Mr. Yatin Chenny, one of the applicant can be submitted. But it is only when the matter was listed for final year and the learned advocate for me requested the appellants to remain present. Would have you to take me proper instructions? At that point of time, it was informed that the heirs come, that the appellant number one come has been passed away and his heirs come would be. And the, and the heirs come would be required to be brought on the record 
details are provided in the process form that will be duly offered and result and the form of the abatement. It is urged that the abatement form be set as a query at the number one. Next, Mr. Nirashan Ramu, Assistant Ramu Kuru form as left. Requested this court form to pass appropriate orders having regard to the elements. So, also the oral submission from the present application form deserves to be allowed and is accordingly allowed. The abatement is set as a abatement where the appellate number one form is set as a in the caption first of number 215. 2015. Civil application succeeding is according to the law of the state of civil application for condemnation of the law. Similarly, the law and the heirs form are or another order than civil application for bringing the heirs. Same. The present application is a law and the district is separate order. Applicant number 1.1. In 1.2, where is the family tree of the apple in number one? Can't be by partiality. The family tree is by Shetra and Sarada. So the wife, the widow, and the son. Yes. In the applicant numbers 1.1 and 1.2, being the legal heirs of the apple in number one, are directed to be brought on the record. In the first appeal, the, they are there or they are not there? Yeah, okay. They are there. First appeal, they are there. Yes, ma'am. Then appellate, not yeah, legal heirs. Legal. I am talking about the heirs. Yes, we are not there. Obviously. Then why in your application you have shown them as one point one and one point two as a proposed respondent? Proposed. One point one. The proposed are uh, legal heirs. That is opponent, it is for Apple and number 1.1 and 1.2 and directed to be brought on the record. Necessary amendment form to be carried out in the caption in the cost title. Who has filed this application for bringing heirs on the record? The son himself. Yes, ma'am. Jayesh Bhai, son of Kanti Bhai, Parsotam Bhai. Yeah. Yes. 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 Necessary amendment to be carried out. Within a period of two weeks. In a period of two weeks from today. In the cost of yes, amendment to be called. Yes. Civil application stands at that. So, two civil applications seeking condemnation of the 404 and 464. Two civil applications setting aside the abatement and including the legal issue. 1.1 and 1.2, the mother and the son. Yes. This will similar. Uh, uh, what about uh, number of days? Well, I guess. In second, 261. 261, what is the status? Legal as delay 111 days. Just a minute. 261. First, we please come to the abatement. Yes, ma'am. For setting aside the abatement. Now, Four. How much is the delay? Abatement 404 days. Hmm? In 261, first appeal 261, civil application condonation of the 404, similar order. Abatement to be set as set. And then impediment. An impediment of the legal heirs, where the delay appears to be of 111 days. Where is the. For bringing legal heirs, 111 days. 111 days. Where is the pedigree? It is. Think? Page seven has placed on record the death certificate as well as the family tree. And as for the family tree, form, the heirs are required to be brought on the record. So all the heirs, they are the they are the applicant here. In third matter, two sixty three, heirs for seventy seven days. 
and abatement seven. We are at the stage of two sixty. Lot, lot, lots. I'm sorry. Just wanted to know that this application has been filed by. Yes. We proposed. I'll buy more. More budget. More budget. Yes, sir. One point two. This is filed by the one of the years for being brought on the record. So this will be more two sixty. Two applicants. Very well. So then, us my order will be slightly different. The heirs of applicant numbers, applicant numbers one and two, both. So how then can be a consolidated application? Mohan Mohabbat Singh. He says about applicant number one point two. And what about uh, the applicant number two then? They are basically family uncle, real. Yes, but. Ah, ah. If lordship may see. Then you are right. You know, we know, but the whether they know. That they are brought on the There is no dispute. Mm -hmm. I have, yeah. And in third matter. At times we never know what kind of uh, dispute may arise in. There is no dispute. As such. Mr. Soni, as of today, you are right. But it is difficult to at least foresee, which is likely to be. We have been, we have come across such kind of dispute. As are not brought. They are uh, not being issued notice. They are not aware about the proceedings. And if you say matter, that you are appearing for the respondents, we will record. Yes, sir. Mr. Sudhir, for the proposed response. And the third application is? De for bringing legal heirs, 77 days delay. Just a minute. Which is that? 263. 263. Where are the papers of 263, Mr. Vargas? Yeah. No. So, same, similar pattern of follow karna. And 17 days for abatement. Abatement me 17 days. Yes. Abatement is 17 days. Abatement set aside. And as me, this right everywhere, Mr. Yatin Soni for the as. This may delay. How much is the delay? Uh, delay 77 for days. 77 for bringing legal heirs. Yes, for bringing and, legal heirs. And 17 days for setting aside the abatement. 17 for setting aside the abatement. And petition is filed by son. Yes. For the responding heirs. You have the vakalat man of all of them yes. in your paper? Where yes, is that? I have filed my law along with this application. Yes, where is that? You would like to see, Mr. I have yes, filed. It is there. Yes. Now, one look so far, the amendment is come. Amendment, first of all, you need to bring them on the record. Lots of Necessary amendment in the application to be brought, to be carried out within a period of two weeks. Lots of After two weeks, keep other matters applicable. Lots of okay. Very much obliged. Thank you. Just go down. And so far the amendment is concerned, you are opposing that? Then file the reply to us. Only for just for, for his uh, Supreme Court. Just I, I'm now let him he go through this judgment. No, please give I, I, yes, I'm so in advance, my lord. The uh, Supreme Court says that in land acquisition matter, the claimant has not to require to be mentioned the how much amount he is claiming. Yes. Amendment by way can be granted. In land acquisition, also just like MACT, that suppose if I claim 500 rupees, ultimately, court conclude conclusion that market value is 1000, then I'm also entitled for 1000 by paying the deficit court fees. That is a view taken by the Supreme yes. Court. Yes, my lord must be aware. Therefore, my lord, uh, I, I have just uh, in my. Sister, please, why don't you go through this? We can then. Uh, and uh, sir, this judgment is for the amendment, my lord, that this two judgment. But what if the amendment is to relate back? Yeah, interest is all I, we are required to pay court fees, my lord. Yes. EIA 2011 Supreme Court Supplementary 625. The first head note that may be saying itself, my lord. We are not so based on this judgment, my lord. In several matters, mm -hmm. our high court has announced the even at the stage of appeal. Appeal, appeal, appeal. Appeal, my lord. Where is that? That observation, where is that observation? We can understand the reference. Yeah. Because Mr. Mr. Soni, please indicate that paragraph wherein it has been said that at the stage of appeal. Appeal is always 
uh, appeal is always in continuous proceeding. Malur. Then what is the evidence, Mister? Right. We have to leave the Wait, evidence. Evidence. Malur, we are. If you say ten rupees, you must have read the evidence only for ten rupees. No, no, no. That's why I'm just in a reference court. Yes. We have sought five thousand rupees. Yes. Malur. Then let, let us see where is that even. Uh, only for query, just Malur. On, okay. Only one minute, Malur. In reference court, what we in rep. Section 11, 12 rupees was awarded. Yes. Reference was filed. We sought 5,000 rupees. Court has awarded 225. So, in reference court, we have already claimed 5,000 rupees. This is one thing. Now, court has awarded 225 rupees. So, initially, when appeal was filed, we have filed for additional 500. Mr. Now, Mr. Sony, we are not saying anything to you. We only would like to know from you that please indicate that the paragraph wherein it has been stated that even at this stage of appeal, such an amendment can give up. What we find here is at the rate, at the stage of section 18 reference. Section 18 reference, yes, Malu. Yes, I, 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 I'll read Malu. Section 16. Therefore, Malu, hey, section court says, Malu, that claimant is not supposed to mention the amount claim. Therefore, now, therefore, Malo, it is always discretionary part on the part of the claimants, Malo. That is what my submission is. Area of measurement, yes, it cannot be changed. But so far, the amount of compensation is not. Therefore, Malo, let, let him go through if he want to file affidavit after going through. Yeah, or on that day, Malo, I will just satisfy the Honorable Court. Mm -hmm. This is at the stage of reference, not at the stage of hobby. But the question is still, my lord. Yeah. But all the evidence would be as per the uh, we, your. But we have claimed yes, five thousand. We appreciate the evidence. We have you already. Allow, Mister, if you say that X amount is the market value and not the Y amount, lot right? Before the reference code, everything was open. Uh, before, uh, everything was open. Yes. Right. So all the evidence. Would, must have been led as per section, say for example, rupees 10. You must have said that, that 10 rupees is the market value, not the uh, not rupees 5. So ev ev evidence as per section, as per rupees 10. Here you say not rupees 10, but 20. No, it's not that. In reference code, we have sought 5,000. See the need. Well, in the reference code, we have sought 5,000 rupees. Court has awarded 200. Now, what now you say? I'm saying, my lord, in reference court, we have sought 5,000 rupees per square what meter. Is your amendment in the present uh, uh, lord, of proceedings? Yes. We, we, 4,000 rupees. Total. So reducing the yes, yes, total. I, I, I'm just, that's why, my lord, I mean, yes. in, 12 rupees was awarded under section 11. By, uh, by the yeah. land acquisition officer. Land acquisition officer. We have filed reference. In, in reference, court, we have sought 5,000 rupees. 5,000. 5, yes. Court has awarded 225 rupees. Very well. Yes. Now, what is your uh, in, in appeal, in initially, when we have filed appeal, we have asked for further 500 rupees only at the time of initial appeal. So, 5,500? 5, 5, so, 725. So, so that was a claim. Now, we are claiming 4,000 rupees. Yes. It, so, therefore, we are required to pay the court fees for balance amount, but we are not crossing our 5,000. Yes. Nothing much would turn up. You can understand 5,000. Yes. That, my Lord is absolutely right. And I have to pay Balance court fees for the amendment. Yes, yes, very good. After two weeks. Lots of, very much. Good. Yes. All the civil applications disposed of. Right? Yes.
Yes. Divorce suit has been dismissed by the Honorable Court below. Yes. Because the marriage is of 2000 court. Mm. There is a baby boy begotten from the marriage. Yes. He was born on uh, 5th of February 2010. Yes. So there are 498 proceedings. There are proceedings under the Domestic Violence Act which are initiated by the wife. So twice a uh, settlement took place. Could not be fructified. Yes. So husband is before the... Husband is before my law. Once the matter also... It, and uh, in the earlier round of litigation... Mm. An ex parte order was passed that was challenged by wife before this honorable. The matter was thereafter remanded back. Yes. Prior to remand, also a conciliation took place. Yes. However, there was uh, no fruitful result. Yes. And after the remand, the suit again has been tried and it has been dismissed. Has been dismissed. Great. Obliging.
This is actually the question asked in the order is part of the IFO basic structures. He is still referring to one into what matter, but there is no time that is now prescribed by the level of civilization. Now, taken in such a way that consideration, general subdivision is issued by the final department. For this matter, no increase is issued. But I am not issued as such, but I receive the instruction from the final department. The to all the yes, that in all the one one well, yes. so Anyway, well, this we will we will place it after the question. Yes, so that is the order passed by the yes. that I have taken. We would like to have that uh, circular. Yes, sir. As in when you are in receipt of that uh, yes, reservation or the circular, just bring it to all. Yes, Number also I have to take instructions. Yes. This is under consideration. So some time may be given notice. This is under process. This order will be complied by the authority. After two weeks? The four weeks will be given. So where is the election that for me? See, this long duration has nothing to do with the compliance. Of it is long, but we are waiting. No, there is no time limit by the learner's Why you say it was already prescribed by no, in, the the contempt, in the contempt procedure? Yes, contempt petition was done. Eight weeks' time was already given. Yes, 9th of February 23. Eight weeks from today. It is under consideration. It will be half to be a lot of four weeks of. No, not four weeks. I'll try to Ms. Smita Patel, Learned Assistant Government Leader from states that the order is under that the order shall be complied with. Request is made for two weeks. Yes, okay. 30th of yes, okay. request to issue a notice so that the order can get the copy. Notice has not been issued. No, 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 no. not in the first matter. Um, this court has passed an order. On April 15, 2024, <coughs> recording the submission and the submission of inaction on the part of the respondent authority. This will come on 8th of April 2024, as far as the following order. Reproduce the order. Mrs. Smitha Patel, learned assistant, government leader from the former state said some time would be required for complying the for complying the order passed by for compliance of the order. Request is made for two weeks. Let there be a notice to the respondents. Doctor one returnable on. No, they will not be waiting. You can serve on okay. then you would like to take uh, that right. itself? And direct service committee. All are at Gandhi Nagar and district. Yeah. 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 So we have to take steps before the order passed by then you have to go before the very well after six weeks. Civil application for bringing legal case, my lord. This honorable court already ordered pass, my lord. Number two, no, it's the go and serve the respondent. Number two, no, major, no, it's five, they get an order, major, so much. 
once water this one have already passed kiya tha so in the yeah, we are concerned with respondent number 2 is it respondent number 2 has uh, the as of respondent number 2 have been got on the summary could not have been one quarter of this one coordinate bill for the past 17 January 2022. It will already be for civil opinion of the new legal here. Order. There's already an order passed. Yes. 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 Of opponent number two. Yes. Was not I allowed. verify whether the any applications. And I think the pendency of the reference they are disposed of considering the ratio of fertility cashew and liberty is given to the first five. That was in the year 22. 22. Yes, Here also Kitabha our matter is covered, my lord. The delay in first appeal, my lord. There is first appeal delay. Delay is 768 days, my lord. But it, uh, there ground is mentioned, my lord. The, once the. We will have to approve the trial. They will have to approve yes, the yes, trial. Yes, the order Let them approve the trial. Yes, because the 17th of January 22 yes, order, order is law. has given them a permission yes. that it appears that it has slipped out of the mind of the land. Yes, yes. Seven twelve two thousand twenty two after the order passed. Seven. Seven twelve two thousand twenty two after the order passed. Seven. Seven. So there will be some order by the trial. Please just try to finish. We keep it after two weeks or after four weeks. After two weeks. After two weeks. Mrs. Smita Patel and the assistant government will come to take instruction as to what further steps have been taken by the learn by the <coughs> applicant in. In furtherance of the order dated 17th of January 22, passed by this court in civil application. Into bracket for condemnation of the in, in civil application, into bracket for bringing heirs, bracket clause number two of 2019, where in common liberty was given to the uh, this number because at her request, release the matter on 8th of. By the way, to first suppose the deal number thirty one and thirty two. That would have five hundred delays. Five hundred and thirty two days, and I am opposing the deal. I have also filed written reply form. Reply form. Okay, let him pass. So, feedback. Notice not received at 68. Yes, Mr. You are for the respondent. Yes. What should you Permission. Please. 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 Please.
Why is it you appear for this one number? Yes, the last two times you just thought time. So why is this? Uh, there was my there. Yeah, time appeared. Now appear for the claim. The last two times there's a uh, short time for deposing the amount. Yes. Because that's why okay, the matter was examined. Do not deposit it. Then is there any stay? It has to be vacated. Admission and stay book. Today is what? Not the first day on the day. Yes, what is the matter? Mm -hmm. On what basis you say that it has uh, not relied upon the sale instances of uh, the nearby area and has taken recourse of uh, yield matter? Yes. Which party matters? Page number? 40. Yes. 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 Yes.
So what what the learned uh, the, the reference code has taken what into that, consideration? That the learned reference code has helped to observe that rupees thirty was the uh, uh, sale uh, sale price. Mm, yes. But uh, however, the special land acquisition officer uh, has considered twenty two point sixty three. Yes, and fifteen point zero. No, sir. We could not have done this. Yes. So so what is wrong in it? Then they have then uh, the learned reference code has not awarded this thirty rupees. Then then you. Uh, jump on the other uh, method to uh, evaluate the market value that is the zone of sale award. Now that is, if it's a pair of 49 on the same page mm -hmm. 47, yes, the second method is the zone of sale award. Now that page 47, yes, yes, last for a pair of 59, yes, then we have a zone of sale award. Now that is, yes, then the learner reference code has discussed the earlier award, the second 10 percent appreciation. Yes, your lordship. And the, uh, is given 10% appreciation every year. Yes. Then there are 60 on page 48. Yes. Every there are 60 years. So the Rajiva Gandhi for a civil procedure now, open page number, Sunday, all our case number, one of the Tarmo, that's a very bad number, Sienkana Tarmo, and 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 Sienkana in the present case, going to 2012. 2012. Yes, in the present case. And the earlier reference, 95. That's the reference which is given at the era, era 63. Where the notification was issued at the present era in the year 1995. Mm -hmm. Now, yes. Yes. So he has given 10% uh, appreciation every year from 95 to 2012. Yes, Mr. Chair. There was a sale instance available of. You could have at least considered those sale instances instead of giving 10% appreciation every year for of the land which was acquired in the year 1995. Yeah, that, yeah. there is a judgment of the honor Supreme Court. 10% appreciation, yes. yes. But when there is no other sale instances available, here this 30 rupees and what was there? Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, so whether the learned the reference court has observed that in absence of any document, <coughs> whether you raise an objection. The learned reference court has uh, that he has not controverted that. In his cross examination, the uh, original payment has said that they are uh, growing the crop of sugar. Sugar cane, yes. However, in the uh, seven trail expert, there is uh, the topak and all these are uh, reflected, not sugar cane. Now, let me have the. 
that age group is that has extreme cold. Yeah, not only sugar cane, but also this cotton and. Uh, but the main reliance was on the sugar cane. Sugar cane. ડોક્ટર and that to common absence of any evidence produced by the claimants so it was claimed that the up uh, uh, the claimants common have been growing cotton and wheat and this thing from the bottom bad list have common no evidence was produced and solely relying upon the solely relying upon the the aspect of doing the agriculture activities of sugar cane farm that the learned reference court form has awarded how much amount has been awarded 137 per square meter or per square meter 137.50 per square meter per square meter 137.50 so per mill irrigated and 101 103 for non irrigated for irrigated and for non irrigated how much 103.13 103.13 103.13 which comma would be on a higher side which would be exorbitant compared to the same instances which were available for the very for of the nearby village of the nearby area let's stop admit and what about the civil application is civil application we should notice to the respondents to return in the law we can talk in 2024 mr kamlesha planner is planner that it will you will for the Yes, service of notice. Look for the original claimant. Look for acquiring body, Mr. Antani. On behalf of the original claimant. You just will find out for Mr. Antani. And Mr. K. Antani, I know that it is the respondent in the case. That shall be still of the operation institution and implementation of the judgment. Judgment due to. How much? What is the date? 992021 on condition that the appellant from african farm deposits the entire awarded amount together with cost and interest by the next date of year please no part payment let everything come all the all the things all the same yes will mr ng kathri yes let that it with me મિસ્ટર I'm Bhishma Rawal, appearing for the 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 On the earlier occasion, I I I have already filed filed my reply. Uh, yes. This is the CA for stay. Unfortunately, I don't have the file at the moment. Uh, mm -hmm. my Lord, pass it over. Yes, pass it. You must be obliged.
Divorce decree has been allowed, my lord. Yes. I am appearing for wife <clears throat> on the ground of cruelty, my lord. Yes. My respectful submission is that uh, if efforts may be made for mediation, because the uh, daughter is having the age of five years. The one at Mr. <clears throat> Nikesh. That has been referred to the mediation. Oh, yeah. No. I know the I'm sorry if I am not aware. I think so. It is not. Referred. No, it has not been. Mr. Mikesh Alvandos, Lani Reddy, and Mr. Let me be our Lani Reddy, and John requested this group to refer the matter to the mediation center. I get a bit. That's why that should be this. Okay. Immense to oblige my Lord, so please. Number 56. Yes. Yes. I have received instruction to appear on behalf of the respondent. You appear? Received instruction to appear on behalf of the respondent. I am requesting for Kartik Vipandi. Mr. Kartik. I will submit that uh, or states that he has received instructions to appear on behalf of the respondent. Respondent husband. On behalf of the respondent, request is made for some time after vacation. Both the matters, 56, both the 57, matters. both the matters. All right. I am requesting for password. Yes. On, on behalf of? On behalf of Deepak Ardhavi. Mr. Deepak Ardhavi. Very good. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, <laughs> Have you deposited the amount? And also, I will give instructions. Is it instructions? Right. Well, keep it back. I'm seeking a question. Why? It is the order passed by the High Court confirming the order of uh, Honorable Commercial Court. We have some objection uh, since this matter has been pending since 
2019 इफ शॉर्ट डेट में बी ग्रांटेड मेगा मैन जानी अपियरिंग इन दिस मैटर शॉर्ट अकोमोडेशन मिला तो बिहार ऑफ मिस्टर ढो क्या देर बीन सम मेडिकल इमरजेंसी इन फैमिली देयर फॉर यस टू शॉट द टेकिंग ऑफ मी ओब्लाइज This reply is filed by the Monday uh, uh, day. It doesn't appear to have been filed. Please take instructions, Mr. Chairman. In compliance of the order. Mm. Yes, it appears. It is filed. No, after the fifteenth of February, no affidavit is filed. Please take instructions after two weeks. Yes, obliged. Janet is coming on this vacation. After vacation, Mr. After vacation. Sir, I'm just checking. After the property is filed, isn't it? Yes, ma'am. After vacation. This is the matter in which they filed an affidavit that they will make the payment within six weeks, and yes. then it was not made. Then they. Based on record affidavit, the crux of the clarification which my lawyers have directed is based on the record, and their clear cross which they were filed in the original case. They're eligible. They're eligible. Their original prayer in the SCA, yes. my lawyers have directed to place on record yes. because I pointed out to my lawyers that we have denied the benefit on the ground that the UIP policy and the central center they were not eligible as of the UIP policy. Mm -hmm. After filing the affidavit, after they filed the affidavit prior to that, that we'll make the entire payment. This was the very stage then taken before the previous coordinate contempt. Let us see. Let us see. They denied. What exactly your prayer was and what has been granted and what direction? At two o'clock. Let us see. 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 उटिंग 
And I I if I can't hear objection, I have a word. Then it should have been mentioned to your tradition. No, the objection, no. objection was in not in yes. But it is not mentioned anyway. It has gone to 25th. Only request is get on 25th, either your tradition is passed in order, or on order, or I am in the government yet to request your tradition. That is always an you may just you may request we will consider you know, it not that we are number 56 what the name we would we will we'll we'll just follow the matter today was the day where it could have been taken today up. today uh, mr sanjanwala for your information we have reached up to which number 69 we are at sale number item number 69 in the board. Ah, never I could have handled it today. Yes. <coughs> yes. Mr. Mr. Sanjana, you need to request to your counterpart, Mr. Pari. Yes, sir. We will be as in when the matter, Mr. Mr. Sanjana, if the matter is called out on the board, from the board, we will take up the matter. Yes. Mr. Sanjanwala, we have already passed the order. No. We have already next, signed the order. Next time, I am stability. We don't, uh, we have, like, that, we, that practice we have not developed. Yes, Mr. Yes. 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 I told her because we have filed one of the LPA, let us patent of it. Yes. The Honorable Court has given to give the set of LPA to her. I have given set to her. But yes. her name was not shown on 28th of March. That is where the Honorable so Court what is. What is your request to do? 22nd of uh, April, the LPA is kept. She yes. knows her very well that LPA is on 22nd. Yes. I told him, her also by SMS, don't take priority. After 22nd, you may take any day. After 22nd. 22nd April, well, next yes. week, so when LP is on the board. Yes. Let us pretend that it's first written in the first to be done was by January 10th, January 2024. Yes. Did nothing has been done. Yes. So my request is that it may be taken up. So there is no she was actually. not there, her name was not there. I was ready with the LPA. But her name how, was not shown. How, how the, the issues, court is, Miss Miss Mandavi, how the issues between the learned educators will be taken care of by the court? Yeah, no, no, that yes, and then when the matter is called out, we'll take up the matter. No, after yes. 22nd, what is this request? After 22nd, yes. one of these matters. Yes, please, Miss Kim. This was written My request is that uh, there is no stay at such a means uh, in the order of the law. But the latest patent appeal is being heard. Well, we'll keep it on 23rd. 23rd. <laughs> Yes. yes, very well. After the mentioning, yes, yes. we'll take up the matter. Yes. 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 The connected three matters are not respected. Yes. So, what is all, the, all this? Uh, all what this are you supposed to do? All these matters for the yes. uh, Then, file a note or whatever the application or order, order, order is already passed. Yes. So why order if if order is passed and all, items the, are not listed the then? Well, what is this? Because all order. this work happens arise from the common judgment yes. and order. Same thing. Yes. Your order to be listed. On 16th of January. Yes, January. Okay. Just call for order. When do we want this? After thing? vacation. After vacation, all the matters will be listed together. Hmm? Okay. So serial number 31 and 32. Both both the matter matter yes, two yes. 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 Serial number 66, Mr. Kapadi has filed a leave. Serial number 66, my love. 56. 66, my love. 66. I'm requesting for a short leave, my love. We have some urgency. We filed an amendment in this MCA. I think uh, it was called out. Uh, it yes. is in agent. Yes, yes can, I, can I request for a short leave, my love? Short leave? Yes, my lord. Yeah, short leave. Sixth of me. Oblige, my lord. Serial yes. number 150150. Yes. Requesting for 23rd of April, short leave. 
उंट आकाश गुप्ता गवर्नमेंट असिस्टेंट गवर्नमेंट लीडर कॉम स्टेट्स बिफोर दिस को स्टेट्स दैट टू इश्यूज कॉम वर कंसर्न leave and cashman small semi colon leave and cashman and gratuity full stop so where is leave and cashman is concerned from the same as we know the benefit has been extended for the purpose of just a, for the the so where is the benefit the same the benefit has been extended Full stop. For graduate form, some time be ex, some time be granted, and this during which form the same will also be processed and extended. Next paper, Miss Real Shah, learned advocate form, states as the leave and engagement form has been the benefit of leave and engagement has been extended only in case of one of one of the applicants for another applicant form that is still awaiting. उंट Yes. Lord, interest amount was to be paid it by. It is paid or it, it is, is being paid. paid. It is paid. I will make sure that it is paid. I can confirm. It is paid. And Lord, district panchayat has to pay interest amount. We have passed order. Check is ready, and C S to go and collect it. You know, I am told C S no. Well, C S collected the check also. So given interest portion is also given. Yes. My Lord, may see the check. Interest portion check is there. And that amount is paid directly by bank. True. So the reimbursement is already done. Yes, Lord. That is by Treasury Officer in Bharuj. So of how do we know that it has been done? My client is my client is informed me on telephone. Did you receive that? No, no. We are not doubting. Yes. We are just trying to understand. Yes. 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 Uh, treasury officer, he no, said. He said, "House no, officer to not, treasury." Mr. Mr. Munsha, why we are asking? Because in the morning it was not done. No, the reason because is because the only development which was informed to the court was a communication by the state government on ninth of April. Yes, 30th. I also said so. Yes, you also said so. But Lord, now there, there, there after what happened? Yes, Lord, the treasury officer was asking for certain papers which were with development commissioner or state government authority. Yes. So did you appeal over? Yes. And he said that this is the position. Yes. You please clear it. He yes. sent his accounts officer from district panchayat also, and it is done. My learned friend is here. Yes. So far, interest is so concerned. We also made the payment. So far as the treasury office is concerned, yes. it is paid through RTGS directly to bank. RTGS, you have confirmed it. So what is the amount which you have received to RTGS? That is around one lakh fifty thousand. Yes, I recollect. One lakh forty six. One lakh forty six. Yes. 
And what about the interest? No, it is there. Seventy-four thousand six eighty-five. No, yes, that is next page. Yes. He, she has collected that also. So this is a check. Yes. Ma this you have received. You have received. Right. He has received the check. So both the principal amount and the interest has been received. We keep it tomorrow. Let him come. Yes, no problem. Tomorrow, Mister. Tomorrow. Just uh, verify from your. Yes, verify just now. Uh, After I convert to you. Very well. Then we dispose it of this petition. Hmm? Today, Mr. Nilesh Sharma, Learned Assistant Government Legal Com, upon instructions, comma states that necessary communication was issued to the You had given in the morning that communication of 9th of April. <laughs> 9th of April 2024. Requiring the district development officer. The office of the district panchayat baruch to pay the amount outstanding towards the medical reimbursement mr the same comma is directly to be taken on behalf mr munsha mr himan munsha learned advocate appearing for the Respondent Panchayat, you are appearing for the Respondent Panchayat? Yes, I am appearing for, for respondent number three and, panchayat, four. Comma, three and four. Has made a statement that the amount, an amount of rupees 1,47,029 has been paid yes. to the applicant through RTGS and the uh, a remaining amount my lord is by treasury officer by the treasury office and the amount of rupees 74,685 towards the interest at the rate of 9 percent comma has been paid through check yes the Mr. check is collected the yes. check comma is also collected by the applicant mr m a sapa yeah. Learned advocate appearing for the applicant, comma, has stated before this court that the applicant, comma, has received the amount and the grievance received the amount. Full stop. Next pair. Since the order, comma, stands complied with, accepting the apology tendered, comma. This court comma deems it appropriate to close the contempt proceedings. Right. Notice is discharged. Civil application is disposed. Very okay. My lord, but if you don't have that order as well as the same, everything is directly taken on the right. huh? Mr. Munshaw, that is directly to the on the I will be more than if some direction will be given that I can find an appropriate to find appropriate. Miss Migna Patel, papers in Miss Migna Patel, I made advocate from. Seeks commission to withdraw the caption application <coughs> with a liberty to take out the with a liberty to take out appropriate proceedings before the appropriate court. The question exited to 
application is application is displayed for first weekend. No, that is too fast. Are you? Yes. Sixty nine. Here on last occasion, your matter was heard. Yes. The the respondents took a stand. We did their order dated fourth of October two thousand twenty three. That if you go in some particular colleges, then only you will be granted full salaries for the further studies, and not now. After that, we showed some policies and some orders to the previous coordinate bench. The court was not convinced. Hence, they asked the state respondent to get some clarification. Their clarification will be at page number. What can say for clarification was preferred by them. The relevant part is at page number two hundred and twelve. What is two hundred and twelve? Ah, this is the relevant part of their MCA memo. For they sought MCA for clarification. The clarification starts from page number two hundred and nine. Just a minute. Just a minute. Yes. Uh, why we have yes, just to appraise my court, the facts of let us see the order first. Yes, may I just appraise my court. Yes. Uh, Milos, they filed a contempt challenging that we have uh, not followed the decisions of learned single judge. Yes. Now, learned single judge has stated uh, in their order, given the directions, that petitioners are uh, held entitled to get the benefits of the salary and they are to be considered as per the QIP policy under AICT Act. Yes. Now, after passing of that order, uh, we scrutinize their applications uh, for uh, giving benefit under the QIP policy scheme. Mm. By that, we passed the reasoned order, Milos, on uh, uh, 4th, 4th October 2023, stating that QIP policy in Andarma, there are 83 centers specified from which you have to complete your master's studies. Mm. You have not completed your master's studies from that QIP centers, and therefore, his uh, entitlement would not be benefited to you. So let, us that, see, Milots, let us see the, the QIP policy. petition, uh, the prayer, and yes. the order part. Yes, uh, that is what my lords have directed to place on record. I have placed on record by way of affidavit. Page number 203 is my affidavit. 203? Yes. What was the petition? Uh, yes. Uh, their prayer clause, my lords, I have mentioned at page number 206. Of 206? My 206. Affidavit yes. I filed. Yes. Paragraph number 6. Yes. These were their original prayers in the special civil application. Yes. May I read? Yes, please do. Yes. Uh, clause A. Your Lordship may be pleased to issue a writ of mandamus or a writ in nature of mandamus or any other appropriate writ, watching and setting aside the resolution dated 3 to 2015 passed by Finance Department State. Yes. Of Gujarat, and further may be may be pleased to pass an order directing the respondents herein to permit the petitioners to produce further studies on deputation with on deputation with all benefits as per Q, quality improvement program of all India Council of Technical Education. B. During pendency and final disposal of the petition, uh, your lordship may be pleased to issue a writ of mandamus or a writ of nature or mandamus or appropriate writ uh, staying the implementation and execution of the impugned resolution 3 to 2016. And see, during the pendency of final disposal of the present petition, your lordship may be pleased to pass an order directing the respondents to permit the petitioners to produce further studies under quality improvement program of the All India Technical Education. Now, yes. uh, this resolution was first and set aside by learned single judge on the ground yes. that your resolution is arbitrary to AICT Act and QIP policy. Yes. Because AICT Act was giving five years full salary. And your resolution is giving two years half salary. Yes. Therefore, your resolution is contrary to the AICT Act and the QIP policy frame. Now, this was a limited question before Leonard Single Judge. Now, Milos Messi, on uh, in the same page number 207, I summarize Milos. Yes. Therefore, from yes. therefore, on perusal of the above prayers, it is also evidently clear that neither the AICT Act nor the QIP policy was challenged. And merely the government resolution dated 3 to 2016 was challenged. I therefore respectfully submit that if the petitioner wants to claim the benefit of quality improvement program, then mandatorily they have to abide by the conditions mentioned in QIP program. And without challenging the said QIP policy, the policy itself cannot be diluted, specifically when the resolution itself was forced and set aside, in my, keeping in mind the AICT Act and QIP policy. And the interpretation of the petitioners that they have been give, given deemed benefit, keeping aside the QAP policy, may not be considered. This I have summarized with respect to that yes. figure. Now, uh, 
one last location mirrors i have pointed out to so my so the resolution oh, yes which was providing for uh, two, two years and half, half years. salary two and half years or two years no two years half salary two years half, half salary, salary. Was cost and service. Was cost and service. So again, the uh, AICT policy would revive. AIP, AIP. So they have to uh, QIP as per the AICT yes, yes. Act or the policy will. Act and policy be... would come into place because come this resolution place. itself was cost and service, <laughs> keeping in mind the QIP yes. policy and AICT Act. Yes. Therefore, AICT Act and QIP policy was kept on higher pedestal while passing this resolution because yes. it is a central act yes. and central act governed the policy. Therefore, learned single this cost and set aside our resolution. Yes. Now, after this, my lords, my lords, may kindly see our. Now, let us see the uh, judgment of the learned single. Yes. By which your uh, resolution of third of February two thousand sixteen was cost and set aside. Yes. Uh, Where my lords, want to see yes. the uh, uh, operative work. Judgment. Yes. yes. That my lords, it uh, started paragraph number twenty six. I may just point out the page number. The order of learner single just starts from page number thirty six, my lords. Yes. Thirty six of MCA. Yes. Operative part is twenty six, twenty seven, and twenty eight paragraph number. Yes. So, uh, what is paragraph twenty seven? May I read from twenty six? That conclusion starts from twenty six. Yes, please read. Yes, twenty six was a page number sixty six, my lords. Yes. In view of the above legal position, the contention raised on behalf of the respondents that the impugn notification would have would be having force of statutory rule under Article three zero nine of the Constitution of India is not tenable as the provisions of AICT Act nineteen eighty seven and the guidelines framed thereunder would have to be followed. Guidelines means the QIP policy would have to be followed, and any inconsistency between the provisions of the Act and the impugn resolution would be void as held by the Honorable Apex Court. Paragraph twenty seven. Yes. In view of the above, the impugned resolution dated three two two thousand sixteen is required to be quashed and set aside, as the same is contrary to the provisions of AICT Act nineteen eighty seven. The provisions of the rules two thousand two would not be applicable to the petitioners who are eligible for perusing further studies as per QIP policy. Mary. What is this rules of two thousand two? Uh, while giving uh, while uh, issuing this resolution of two thousand sixteen. We have taken benefit of his rules. This is Gujarat rules, two thousand two, which says that you have half salary. You have to pay. On basis of this rule, we issued this notification. Yes. Therefore, Lana Singhal has referred that these rules, which the they are trying, to, would not be applicable to the petitioners. Yes. Who are eligible for perusing further studies as per the QIP policy of AICT Act, as they would be granted leave with full salary on deputation for duration of course up to maximum of five years. Now five years means two years masters and three year PhD. Therefore, total five years. Those who want to pursue my PhD, they can. The provisions of rules fifty seven, seventy seven, seventy eight, and eighty four of the rules two thousand two would be applicable in normal circumstances, and conditions of rule seventy seven for grant of study leave would be subjected to the provisions of AICT Act nineteen eighty seven. As such rules cannot override the provisions of Central Act as held by Apex Court if they are not consistent with the same. Twenty-eight. Therefore, the impugned resolution is hereby quashed and set aside, and the petitioner are, are entitled to get full salary and are to be considered on deputation to peruse further studies as per the QIT policy under AICT Act 1987. Now, yes. pursuant to this, my lords, here there were in the SCA there were approximately one hundred and forty-six petitioners. One hundred and forty-six. One ninety-eight. One ninety-eight petitioners in, in the, the SCA. In the yeah, in the writ petition. Yes. Against which eighty-three petitioners have filed this contempt application. Uh, how many total petitions? Total in the SCA there were one ninety eight. Yes. Contempt is filed by eighty three. Yes. In amongst this eighty three, thirty five persons are those who have completed their master education. They have completed how? They have completed by colleges in Gujarat. Yes. And they want to claim the benefit of QIP policy. What about the rest? Rest have not completed. They will take admission. They will take admission. They are yet to take admission. Right. So Now, if at all they want to yes. avail of the benefit yes. going from the QIP, QIP policy, policy they have to they have to undertake the studies in the colleges mentioned in mentioned in the QIP centers, which are specified centers. by the QIP policy itself. In this thirty-five, they have not undertaken the studies. No, from uh, those that is what. Now, after order of learned single judge, we. 
दे हैव गिवन एप्लीकेशन के तमाम ने बेनिफिट आपो पीएपी पॉलिसी में देयरफॉर वी स्क्रूटिनाइज देयर एप्लीकेशन के लोग क्या थी बनेलू छे देयरफॉर वी पास द रीजन ऑर्डर माय लॉर्ड्स मेसी पेज नंबर 102 that is after passing orders by learned single judge page number yes. 102 yes yes meritum prastavna namdar high court na vachana legal sandarbh number 1 mujab na chukada ni namdar high court dwara sarkari engineer college અને પોલિટેકનિક ખાતે અધ્યાપકોને ઉચ્ચ અભ્યાસ માટે અમલી શિક્ષણ વિભાગને તારીખ 3/2/16 નો ઠરાવ એઆઈસીટી ના અધિનિયમ 1960 સો ની વિપરીત હોવાથી સદર ઠરાવ રદ કરીને ક્યુઆઈપી પોલિસી અંતર્ગત પિટિશનર અધ્યાપકોને ઉચ્ચ અભ્યાસ માટે પૂરા પગાર માટે હકદાર ગણી તેમને ડેપ્યુટેશન પર ગણવાનો આદેશ કરેલ છે ક્યુઆઈપી એઆઈસીટી એક સ્ટોપનર અને એમએચઆરડી દ્વારા આવેલમાં આવતો પ્રોગ્રામ છે જે નાઇન્ટીન નાઇન્ટીન સેવન્ટી માં ભારત સરકાર દ્વારા શરૂ કરવામાં આવેલ છે આ પ્રયત્ન મુખ્ય ઉદ્દેશ એઆઈસીપી માન્ય ડિગ્રી ડિપ્લોમા એન્જિનિયરિંગ કોલેજ અધ્યાપકોને ગુણવત્તા વધારો કરવાનો છે જેની સીધી અસર વિદ્યાર્થીઓના અભ્યાસની ગુણવત્તા સુધાર પર થાય છે એઆઈસીપી દ્વારા ડિગ્રી અને ડિપ્લોમા એન્જિનિયરિંગ કોલેજના અધ્યાપકોને ઉચ્ચ અભ્યાસ એમની અને પીએચડી માટે એઆઈસીપી દ્વારા ક્યુઆઈપી જાહેર કરેલ છે અને તે અંતર્ગત ડિગ્રી અને ડિપ્લોમા એન્જિનિયરિંગ કોલેજના અધ્યાપકો એઆઈસીપી દ્વારા મંજૂરી મેળવવા જે અધ્યાપકો દ્વારા સ્ટડી લીવ લઈને અભ્યાસ કરવામાં આવેલ હતો અને પૂર્ણ પગાર ચુકવવા માટે નામદાર હાઈકોર્ટના આશરે લીધેલ હતો પ્રસ્તુત કોર્ટ કેસ અન્વયે નામદાર કોર્ટમાં એમસીએ સો એન સો ઇન એસસી એ કુલ એટી થ્રી પિટિશનર્સ પૈકી તેની વિગત નીચે મુજબ ની છે ડીસેપરેટર with the petitioner yes. okay, you, they have to challenge this orders because qip policy ma tame na padho so therefore they have to challenge the qip policy okay, irrespective of koi pan college ma tame karo you should give me benefit yes. without challenging they they prefer me was this contempt application okay you give me direct a benefit because learned single judge what they are interpreting is ke learned single judge has given deemed benefit by waiving of the conditions of the qip policy yes. and waiving of the conditions of the icit act in my resolution submission it is not correct therefore we prefer clarification now ideally milos the clarification was to be preferred by the petitioners ke learned single judge would clarify ke bhai humne pan samavesh thavo jo but we preferred clarification in clarification we uh, milos may see my clarification application milos have asked me to put on record yes let me know chai nx from page number 209 milos ji page number milos number 55 yeah, not nxc initial with the second copy initials are not there okay. together with the other set uh, in my reply 
the government of india launched few uh, quality improvement program in their 1970 one of the main let us not read the issues i am not going what are the uh, conditions Since contained in the uh, policy and what you are uh, required to be fulfilled Five years of teaching experience. Yes, you hence, have five years of teaching so, experience. Yes, the second condition. Hence, then we were so now. Second condition. That's the only condition. Then five years. Not. And there what is this? Uh, what my learned friend is trying to say is there are only eighty-three institutes, but yes. those are major and minor QIP centers. Any college yes. in which AICT approved master courses are going on and which has specific five seats of. We spot, have to see only this, Mister. We are Not only you. to see this policy. Actually, then very. Yes, one you of the just police. you just tell us whether you satisfy all the terms and conditions contained in this policy or not. Not fast. Then there is no specific mention that we, if someone does from any other colleges, we are not permitted. And when the policy itself suggests. That these okay. are the categories of the colleges wherein you have to undertake the studies. Oh my gosh, there is not. Yes. These Then it is a matter of interpretation of the center. policy. You may uh, file a red petition. My lordship, no those are major and minor QIP centers. Attempt. My lordship, may look at yes. this for a minute. May look at page number two sixty two. This is also QIP policy, which was produced before the London Jingle Bell. Yes. This is also QIP policy. The very last portion of it says. It's a matter note. of interpretation, which for. Oh, my lordship, this is a note. It may not so much just. What what it says? Yes. Which policy will apply? Which policy will not apply? Go and seek a clarification before the learner single. There is not the contempt proceedings. No, well, actually, the thing is, this was the very same stand taken yes. by them, which was not accepted by the bench. They sought for the very same clarification. Well, actually, we just have a look at the clarification memo which they produced at page number two hundred and twelve. Yes. What clarification they sought before the learner judge? When is the order passed by the learner single judge in your clarification? Yes. One fifty. It, it, it was rejected. It is rejected. It is rejected. No reasons. Yes. But what she looked at the page number two hundred and twelve. It is the relevant part of clarification which they sought before the learner single judge. Page yes. number two hundred and twelve. Very well. It is rejected. But there is a question of further going into the merits or demerits of the clarification application. We only have to see the judgment of the learner single judge. Yes. The clarification which they sought. Page number two hundred and twelve, para number five. Yes. The applicant submits that as per the opposite direction, the authority has taken a decision on fourth of October two thousand twenty-three, wherein the stand has been taken that out of eighty-three percent, thirty-five percent have studied the various institution, and as per AICT QOP, several institutes have been notified, but the thirty-five percent who are mentioned in the order are not have are not obtained admission or higher education in the stipulated institution as per the AICT QOP policy and. In view of same video order dated so and so, the authority had decided not to grant the benefits to the same person. The copy of the AICT QIP policy in ACI R N I survey that is shown. It is humbly requested to clarify the extent that petitioner would be eligible to take benefits of QIP policy if they satisfy the criteria and should fulfill the conditions of QIP policy. Yes. This was the exact clarification which they sought that we yes. thirty five people will not be granted full salary, yes. and that was rejected, ma'am. After this. Very good. They file an affidavit that we will pay the amount within six weeks. Their affidavits are at page number one hundred and fifty-five. The relevant part is at page one hundred and sixty. There was under misunderstanding of the direction contained in the order. They specifically say that we will pay. You pay. you fulfill the conditions contained in the policy, and you just uh, avail of all the benefits which you are. Uh, the page number one twenty. Eligible to order. order. If yes. last time also my lords have noted in the order that previously also we are just trying to understand the controversy. Not see the other facts. No, no. The thing is previously yes. also when employees who were going to LD Engineering College and other engineering colleges they were granted full salaries. Page we number one twenty nine. Page number one twenty nine. The very same order, my lords. Mistake can be granted to some uh, some class of people doesn't mean that uh, the mistake should be extended to you as well. Not see since nineteen seventies even. Yes, the officers of respondent. Now they will not pay you as per the third of February two thousand sixteen the half pay. They will pay you the full salary, provided you have completed your studies so from the listed institutes. colleges. The AICT says that. We are not here to interpret any policy or the other stuff. The AICT says that if the masters in the is done from an AICT approved institution, then you will be granted that salary. Yes. That QIP policy relevant part is at page number two sixty two. Page number two sixty two, my lord. Two sixty two is what. That entire QIB policy, the relevant portion which that? I rely. Where is that? That QIB policy starts from page number two forty six, 
and the relevant portion. So, what is I the read. difference between these two policies, two forty two and? Uh, they publish 95. every year, my lord. So that's the only thing. This is press UAP policy published every year. And Just a minute. This what was the QRP policy policies. which was prevalent at the time of filing of the red petition and the order of the land and similar judgment? The same policy, mm -hmm. page number 92, which I read. It has been clarified page by AIC2, which my lords referred to 83 Jemma Minor Center. So that, that, that was, was the policy. That was. Yes. And what is, oh. the, what yes. is this page? This is my lords. It is my learned and this page. My lords, can you see? I may just point out what is the difference. UIP of 23. My lords, may see page number 246. 246? Yes. Yes. My lords, may see the last. It is updated as on previous January, 2003. Previous January? Page number 246. 23. And petition was filed in the 2021. year 2021. 2021. 2021. Yeah. This is also Therefore, my lords, that only difference is, okay, in the year 2021, there are 83 centers, which I taken, my lords. Yes. And in this, which my learned friend produced, mm -hmm. my lords, may kindly see page number 262. Yeah, the 97. 97. Actually, the record says, and that is why, why, my lords? Because QIP policy. Any of the institutions of the Gujarat. They have to have apply. Been, they have, yes. Any of the institutions which have been from where from where they have completed the study are included or it is no, it is not included. Not sure. And Milos, it, it is also a procedure that those colleges who mm -hmm. want themselves but, to be certified as yes. a QIP Maybe center, Milos. Explains, so far as your excuse. Milos, uh, only just Mr. Goyal, you need to keep some restraint so far as your I expressions know. are concerned. Please take your seat. And Milos, uh, uh, this is there is also a procedure given by QIP or AICT that those colleges who want to recognize themselves as QIP centers they have to apply to AICT Act for giving them recognition as a QIP center. This is this entire form, my lords. Yes. We don't want to say that entire form. Therefore, the, these colleges does not cover from this, and therefore we deny the benefit. And this is a separate cause of action. They have to challenge the QIP policy, not yes. contempt petition, my lords. Yes, you may make your submission. So the thing is that page number 262 may be the same. Page number 262. Page number 262, Yes. How this policy will apply to you when your petition was signed? Else, my lordship, the QIS AICT was party before the learned single judge. I will bring the AICT on record. We are Whether, not concerned with the AICT. We are only concerned the with the direction of the learned single judge, the policy prevalent as on the date when the order was passed. And you'll be governed by which policy? Yes. Please don't rely upon the policies which are subsequently no, point of time. That submission of the AICT. What AICT says. Yes. Just by this time, you should have done it. For page yes. number 262, my yes. For UIP centers in AICT. Mr. Mr. Goyal, we are not going to look at to look at this policy, which was not there when the petition was filed and the judgment was passed by the Lana Singh. We are only concerned with the policy which was prevalent as on the date of 4th of October 2021. Policy as on that day. Then they made a statement that they will make the entire payment within six weeks. Yeah, that was under a mistaken belief. They were not supposed to do it. But once an affidavit is made, they have to comply you with their order. First, you you uh, qualify yourself first with the uh, by undertaking the studies in the uh, institutions which are listed in the policy, and you are seeking the benefit of that policy. Prior to 2016, this resolution. All the persons were permitted in the Indian College. Not prior to 2016 and not thereafter. We only so concerned with the They were restrained, my Lord, so from yes. anyone to go for further studies. Very in any piece for it. They specifically just say that once that course is approved by AIC, it's not of September 2022. Then I will bring that prevalent, that particular policy, the clarification. My Lord, keep it next week. I'll bring that policy. Why policy? Yes, that it's that it's policy is already report. there on the record. I will bring other policies also, what which were prevalent during that time. Other policy? Also, that we are not concerned with all other policies. Prior to 2016, in very safe colleges, we were permitted to go on further studies. Mm. Very Page number 129 is you the very safe order. You challenge the resolution of 3rd of, uh, 3rd of February 2016. Mm. That resolution has been called and set aside. Your prayer of pursuing further studies as per the QIP policy of AICT has been granted. You have to act as per that policy. We are under that policy only, my Lord. Because we don't find any prior to 2015, 
पेज नंबर 129 में भी सी Yes. Okay, number 129 में This was very good. The clarification, the yes. very safe clarification yes. was so what we call the learned single judge. The <laughs> interpretation was wrong of the state. Hence, the learned single judge rejected the MCA for clarification. That no, this is not required to be clarified. Submission also will consider for deciding the contempt application. Any, Any other submissions? Actually, the most simple submission. They filed an affidavit of compliance twice. With That you have already court. argued. Please don't repeat. Prior, that from 2000 prior to this. That also you have already argued, Mister. Please don't repeat any submissions which you have already argued. Okay. Prior prior as the order tomorrow. Yes. 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 Yes.
cases to be taken up by two persons. So number one, one, two. Government bill. So the response must be managed properly. Thirty-two. Thank you. Uh, the concerned officers are present. Uh, yes. Mr. Hidey Butch is, is to appear on my behalf to assist the Honorable Court. Yes. Uh, he was here just recently. Yes, we are not concerned. When the matter is called off? Yes, the counsel has to be here. Yes. Uh, the yes, direction was to consider my case for grant of pension. Yes. Now, thereafter, they passed an office order yes. saying that uh, we are going to file an appeal and that, uh, that was their stand. They are saying yes. that this is our decision. Now, then a statement was, was made. Yes. Statement was made that no, we will grant the benefit. What was the order of the learning assembly? It is at page 9. Yes. Paragraph number 4. Yes. Considering the submissions and decisions relied upon by the learned advocate for the petitioner, the respondents number 2 and 3 are directed to decide the representation of the petitioner dated 26 12 2022 in accordance with law and also in view of the decisions of the Honorable Supreme Court and this court referred uh, herein above within a period of eight weeks from the date of receipt of this order by speaking order. Decision of the representation dated 26 12 2022 is to be conveyed immediately to the petitioner. Yes, so your representation was to be decided. Yes. Right? This is the direction contained by the language. Yes. Then what happened? The respondents uh, passed the order dated uh, 19-10-2023 at page 26, where they have said that Karyavahi Chalu, sir. And they are saying that this is no. the decision. So uh, the, the representation was to be decided within a period of eight, eight weeks. weeks. So eight weeks were getting over when? Uh, eight weeks were getting over in... Uh, in June uh, 2023. June? 2023. June 23. Please. Yes. And what is that communication since 19th of October 2023? It says Karyavai Chalu. Sir. Karyavai Chalu. That is the only stand taken. Yes. Thereafter, the matter was... What is that communication of 19th of October? The page 26. Sorry. So they have not complied with this order. Then they have not complied. Then from time to time, adjournments were taken. The order sheet may be seen. Yes. Multiple last chances were given to them. Yes. Still, this conduct okay. was not corrected. Then uh, when my lord had taken a strict stand, yes. uh, he made a statement that benefits will be granted within a period of 60 days. 60 that statement days. is recorded. Yes. And thereafter, on the next occasion, it was reported that the officer is on sick leave which was also a false statement mm -hmm. because the officer uh, passed an order dated 9-4-2023. Yes. Mr. Yeah, I, so I, I yes. see that uh, if the order... I'm very court, sorry to say. I understand. Yes. But I, 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 yes. I've seen every order. Yes. I've seen the matter as well. When you don't understand the query correct. of the court, you correct. should at least take the advice of some senior. Advice. Correct, correct. Well, that, your senior, yes. it is, it is, you just it, can't keep on harping. I understand. And hammering. But this was yes. the in fact first matter. The just few matters. First, his first matter had to occur in contempt jurisdiction. Yes. Uh, and first matter of the panchayat. I, no, I understand. It's not, I, I understand. Yes. Uh, it will be yes. uh, will I'll set the things right. Mm -hmm. The appeal is coming up tomorrow. Yes. Uh, the LPA file. In fact, that was also not required. But still, it's it's fine. So yes. it will be let it meet its fate. 
yes. and i have uh, instructed the officers that once it's disposed yes. tomorrow itself yes. uh, all necessary formalities to be undertaken within one week then yes. we'll see that whatever is entitled he is yes. entitled he will get it will why, we'll, why unnecessary i understand i understand i understand so that necessary things are done yes but i was it is not known for all this i things. understand not in fact i was also yes. very uh, in fact shocked by reading your lordship's order my lords are not, normally not getting this yes. strict uh, without any reason so mm -hmm. not proper instructions are conveyed and uh, not, since it was a first contempt matter milord perhaps it was it was not uh, it should have been Then dealt with in a proper prop i understand it yes. should have been dealt with in a in a much better manner instead we'll we'll see that uh, things are put to and where in, are in, in officers in, whether the yes, officers yes so far is number 1 the dd of yes. is concerned about exemption application it, exemption application the civil application is filed for his exemption from personal appearance yes. therefore my friend mentioned in the morning your that it it so is today, fine what is the question of exemption application or today the uh, they have been uh, no no the other officers other are present so far as number 1 is uh, okay. number 1 the present uh, uh, pre sorry number 2 is concerned yes. uh, number 2 uh, he this officer is transferred so the present incumbent the the ddo at present Uh, who is Ask in charge? Ask him to remain present. He will. He, well, Ask him in, to comply with this order of ninth of April. Yes, yes, Lord. In fact, it will. I am yes. saying that it it is being complied. Lord, I have <coughs> received instructions today. The uh, response number three and his superior officer. The three officers are present. I have given instructions. The DDO Lord is because of the election duty. He was he was specifically instructed by the district magistrate to remain present at some some place. therefore exemption application qua the ddo has already been filed yes. but we so far as the compliance is concerned it will be done is yes. is what specific instructions which are given and i have also received to convey to the honorable court yes. so there is no not everything has happened because of the i mean it did not give the impression of ignorance certain all throughout the impression was about the adamant attitude i understand i understand not it in fact this should not have yes i i in fact not in absence of a casual the, attitude yes uh, the was contempt is aggravated because of 9th april order had the yes. 9th april order not come the contempt would have been on non consideration but the consideration has also not been in Then accordance with in the, on the say that the officer is on a sick i and so he and in fact he was there, then there should not have been an order of time of april i i i quite see that in fact yes. uh i see that uh, there's no explanation but i i may not it will be yes. uh, i'll set the things right my lords may have it day after he'll see that Lord, we have it on Thursday. Tomorrow, yes. Lord, uh, once the appeal is over, Lord, we'll we'll see that yes. all formalities and we'll report uh, the compliance. Tomorrow, C A for condonation of delay is yes, on board. Delay There is two argue. years of delay. Yes. Yes. So, yes. so yes. I find a few other. <laughs> Let him. And <laughs> you, even otherwise, Mister Mister. Uh, I understand. Fact, uh, Lane sister. Yeah, just uh, you are apologetic. I understand. But unfortunately, that that expression is not there on the other side. My lord, sorry. 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 Yes. Still, we find that there needs to be done done something. I understand. Yes. I see that five zero four is the. I almost one once I have committed that offence yesterday, yes. but today also. No, <laughs> Mr. Jidayadich, Rani Dadi, the Shabiyan, with Mr. Samrati Dadi, Rani Dadi, the Shabiyan, respondent from at the outset from has tendered apology. It is stated that 
at the outset form I just stated. It is also stated. It is stated that the communication dated 9th of April 2024 ought not to have been issued. Perhaps the same comma was under a misconception. It is full stop. Necessary steps come shall be taken, should I refer, shall be taken in compliance of the order dated 24th of April 2023. It has been reported that the latest patent appeal come is filed, which is coming up for hearing on 16th. 16th of April 2024. 16th of April? 16th, 16th of April 2024. Which come? 16th of April 2024. Request is made for a short day so as to put the house in order. It is submitted that the order shall be complied with. Mr. We are just recording the full statement. Yes. That upon instructions, from the instructions of stated that the order comma shall be complied with, as has been conveyed to him by the respondent number three. Respondent number three, who is personally present yes. before this court. So far as respondent number two is concerned, comma. It is regretted that owing to the election duty one, that he could not remain present. But the officer, oh, uh, the officer, deputy director, animal husbandry, uh, the, the department head, the deputy director, animal husbandry, the departmental head, one is present. It is also full stop. Necessary application comma has been filed seeking exemption. It is therefore urged that so far as the respondent number two is concerned comma, he be exempted from though he was directed to remain present, he be exempted from his appearance, from his personal appearance. Next one. Except exceeding to the assurance and the request made from we are not passing in. this court comma deems it appropriate not to pass further orders. The This is the matter on 18th, 18th. 18th of April 2024. This is the matter on 18th of April 2024 for further consideration. Not. And number three will remain present again on the yes. okay. respondent number three. Sure. Continue to remain Obliged. Immensely obliged. Yes. One thirty one can be taken out. One thirty one. Yes. There are four groups. Two six one one one. Two six one zero.
Yes, Miss Patel. Could you just go to the papers? Yes, I'm. Process is made up of the matter. First appeal number 2610 to 2614. Yes, there are a group of. According to Mr. Sakhari, 131 is absolutely similar. Section 4 is similar. Everything. 131. Yes, 131 to 130. Just I have prepared the chart of all the survey numbers. And when the um, section 4, section 6 notification, which amount, what amount is given by the trial court, and the enhancement is also prepared one chart. So clear everything in each matter. What is uh, first appeal number 131? Yes. Now the first, first Anukram number, then after the FA number. 2610, column number 5 in this English. 2610, that I'm arguing that matter. 2610. No, no, just a minute. Just a minute. How many matters are there to be on four the board? There four are groups. four groups. Four groups. Yes. 131. Yeah, 131 to 134 is one just group. Just a minute. 131 to 134. 34 is one group. Four. This is one group. One then group. what about then one one two? One one two. One one two. There are just two. Yes. Yes, one one two. One one two. There are three three first appeals. First three appeals is one group. Yes. This is one group. Yes. Yes, then two six one zero. Yes. Two. Yes. Uh, uh, remaining is another group. Up to up to two six one four. Others are the cross mind cross objections. Yes, this is a second group. Second group and third group. This will be a third group. One thirty is the third group. A fourth group. This will be a third group. And one thirty. One thirty one to one thirty four is the first group. Yes. One one two two matters. First three matters. First three matters. Three matters. Another. Second group. Six one zero onwards. Third, third group. group. Which is a fourth. One three zero. 130. Item number 130. Yes, 130. This is a fourth group. And this is a fourth one. Yes. What had happened? Just, just so, let us. Uh, yes. Yes. Now let us see the in seriatum the first group. Yes. Right? Hundred and twelve. Hundred and twelve. Huh? Hundred and twelve, the three matters. Three matters. But why I'm saying that one thirty one may be taken up first. first. Reason reason being the other group which has been decided yes. are identical, identical section six. four. Uh, amount which has been awarded is identical. By the reference court, by the land acquisition office, everyone is identical. Yes. These and all are is also is the same. 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 Amount is same. So where is that judgment? Yes. These and these two are the same. What is this uh, second judgment? Relying on first judgment, the, the other matters are also disposed of. Same, very same identical amount. But the if I can. First appeal 669. Yes, 669. Yes, yes. According to you, 131 is identical. Item number 131 is identical. Identical. Let's put it in yes, with yes. facts. All, 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 yes. The, all uh, the these three groups, other three groups, yes. there is an increase which I am saying that the appeal of the government have to be allowed in this judgment, which has been already passed by this honorable court. Yes. The government has preferred appeal against the reference court. That their appeal has been dismissed. Uh, uh, appeal of the government has been dismissed, and my cross objection has been allowed 
yes. to the extent that the learned reference court has deducted 40%. My case is 40% has not to be deducted from the base price. 20% has to be deducted. That has been uh, believed. That deduction was towards what? Yes. But the, this, so, this Sulab Suflam Canal has been passed. Uh, we have relied on the district valuation committee report of the very same village of similar uh, vicinity. The government has decided uh, rupees 570 rupees, 570 of uh, before one month of section 4 notification. That government has decided or what as for the valuation Dis committee? Yeah, district valuation committee's report has been considered. The district valuation committee's report has been considered by the learned reference court. Learned reference court has considered 570 rupees has been decided by district valuation committee. Yes. Therefore, learned reference court has awarded 570 rupees but, but deducted 40% out of it on the ground of smallness. Smallness of amount because the, yes. the, uh, the district valuation committee's report is for the 2000 uh, square meters where in these 5000 square meters have been acquired. Therefore, the 40% has been deducted. Yes. The, against that 40%, we have preferred this cross objection that 40% can't be deducted. The government uh, is against the 570 itself. That five, but ultimately, the district valuation committee's report has been considered very same uh, village. Very, uh, it was before one month of section four, yes. prior to. Yes. Therefore, section four is after the district valuation committee's report. Yes. So, one month what will hardly make any if before uh, the their judgment. Uh, uh, therefore, therefore, the appeals were failed. And my my uh, cross objection to the extent of 40, instead of 40 percent, 20 percent to be considered. Because my argument was, our argument was yes. that there is nothing further to be done. This is already a developed area. Yes. This in vicinity of Lakdi village. This is a further development, nothing further to be done. Therefore, only for the smallness, 20 percent has been deducted and 40 percent out of 40 percent. Yes. Therefore, uh, this amount has been considered. This 131 to 134, exactly same date, same same, same amount, 570. Yes. For other three groups, there instead of wait, 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 yes. So let us see first this judgment and then we'll go to 131 to 134. Yes. No, let us see the judgment. Yes, judgment. 18th of December 23. Yes. Yes. If Lord Sime. Uh, page 30, 30 33 onwards, page 33, para 16. Sixteen, seventeen, and eighteen are the para sixteen. But the judgment is not the same. No, judgment is not same. Not same. Reference is different. Hmm. Papers thirty-one, one thirty-one. 131 Because the main LAR number was yes. different, therefore different. 131 the paper value. Five six five. Yes. 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 
Para 16 of the judgment, if I'm not mistaken. Para 16, page 33. Uh, if the, the facts, facts, yes, facts. Facts, facts I point out. Lordson is para 2. The uh, amount which has been awarded is 33.50 pesa. Lordson is para 2. Land acquisition reference 26 to 31. Yes, 26 to 31 there. there. Yes. And the award was 333.50 mm. in the reference. Yes. Uh, para 4.1, if Lordson may. Yes, please. That the land of the original claimant situated in village Lakhani, Taluka Disa district. Yeah, also Lakhani. Same, so, Lakhani. Uh, came to acquire for the public purpose of trading canal of Sudlam Sudlam. Yes. Notification under section 4 of so and so for the was issued on 30th 6, 2004. Here, Lord, in para ones. Yes. In para one. The section four has been said, Same. and the approximacy last the operative portion page 10. Yes. Section four and section six is the same. Same award date is different by uh, section 11. Award is different, yes. But the approximacy, the operative portion uh, 10. Yes. The awarded amount is also same. The 33.50 yes. Yes, in fact, the evidence which has been considered is district valuation committee's report. Is you also will find it uh, page eight internal page eight para eleven. Yes, Yes, please read it. Yeah, para 11, I yes. Therefore, applying the ratio of judgment of Honorable High Court in case of so and so, present claimants are entitled to fixation of price of their land according to the sale instances of government land. Looking to the exhibit 41 and 42, District Valuation Committee has fixed the valuation of 2000. Square... Para 11? Yes, para 11 of the judgment or oh, impugn judgment. Oh, Lord, impugn I, I, I'm, yes, impugn. Lord, see, once, I may read first this judgment. I may read first this judgment. But there, the date is same. The same. awarded amount is also same, 8.50 by the yes. lead equation officer. Yes. Here also yes. same. Section 4, Section 6 is the same. Same. Uh, here awarded is, amount by lead equation officer is same. 31 of 2005. 5. Uh, 35, uh, this 31 is uh, which? LAQ case numbers? 30. This 131, item number 131, yeah. is yes. LAR case number? LAR is 105 to 107. Of 2005? Five. Yes. The facts. Para 16, at page 33 can be seen. 15, but what is para 15? 15 is 14. 14. If I can read it, 14. Yes. We consider the ratio laid out. Yes. It is a ratio whether the district valuation committee report can be relied on or not relied. Yes. We have considered the ratio laid down and the principal annexation in the opposite decision. It is found out that the principal governing determination of market value of the land acquire well settled. And at the time of determination of compensation on the Supreme Court, issue certain directions as regards to the method of valuation of the consideration. First, opinion of expert, price paid within the reasonable time in bona fide transaction of a purchase or sale of land acquired or for the land adjacent to the those acquired and possessing similar advantages. Three, the number of years purchase of actual or immediate prospective profits of the land acquired. Therefore, the valuation made by the valuation committee can be valid basis for the reference court. In deciding valuation of a land for the purpose of awarding compensation, subject to any change in the nature of the land, 
character etc if the impugn judgment and or order of the reference court is examined in light of the aforesaid observation and discussion it appears to us that there is no error committed by the reference court in relying upon the price fixed for the allotment of the land for the public purpose of trading canal of sudlam suflam but the reference court has committed error in not considering the aspect that the valuation was made of the land in question on 28th 5 and the said valuation is to be considered keeping in view of the principal as observed hearing above and the reference court has also totally lost sight of in not considering the deduction to be made in the nature of the land allotted to non for non agriculture purpose and the acquisition of the agriculture land in the present case from the facts of the case as stated above it is found out that it is the case of the original claimant that the valuation committee has fixed the valuation of the government land on so and so whereas the notification under section 4 of the act was published on 30th 6 2004 after the fixation of the valuation of a land by the valuation committee and hence they are entitled for additional compensation for which reliance is put put upon the decision of this court in case of so and so as well as in case of so and so and though aforesaid facts have been pointed out before the reference court it has not been considered and 40% deduction was made instead of 20% which the original claimant are entitled for we have gone through the record and proceeding found out that the reference court has considered the re report dated 28 5 of the valuation committee it is found out that the reference court has correctly evaluated the report of the valuation committee but at the time of considering the amount 40% of amount is deducted from the said amount mentioned in the report solely on the count that in identical matters in case of so and so delivering so and so the division batch of this court has deducted 40% amount from the price fixed by the competent authority it is found out from the record that it is a said matter the acquired land was situated in outskirts of the city area wherein in the present key land it is acquired by the acquiring body situated within the center of the city as per the evidence laid by the original claimant surrounded in vicinity area of the acquired land is well developed and in the future government need not have to spend any amount for the development of the said area therefore the basic price value of the said land is on higher side therefore the deduction is required to be made 20 instead of 40% we have gone through the record and proceeding and found out that the land which was which was acquired by the acquiring body in small plot and situated within the center of the city therefore we are of the opinion that the original claimants are entitled for 20% deduction instead of 40 deduction we have considered the report of district valuation committee uh, village lakhni dated so and so produced at record at exhibit 4041 as well as the map of the village produced on record it is found out that the aforesaid document that the price of the land of the uh, of bearing survey number 152 paiki has been evaluated and fixed at 510 or uh, this is 570 the correction has been made in speaking to minute yes. and sudlam suflam canal pass to the uh, land bearing survey number so and so and the said land are situated adjacent to the land owned by the original claimant it is also found out from the record that the land owned by the original claimant are situated within well developed area which would require the expenditure behind the development and therefore after acquiring the said land government did not have to spend money for its development thus considering the above facts of the case on hand the original claimants are entitled for deduction of 20% instead of 40% which mm -hmm. has to be done in present case at this stage it is particular to note that we have go also gone through the impugn judgment and award passed by the learned reference court including finding given but in conclusion arrived at the learned reference court and found out that except deduction of 40% instead of 20 There is no error committed by the learned reference court, which requires it of yours. Well, so uh, the uh, appeal filed by the state government state is dismissed on the ground that uh, this uh, report district of valuation. the district valuation committee is to be accepted. Except, and whatever price determined towards the market value is to be considered. To be yes, to be considered. So, as the deduction is concerned, instead of forty percent, twenty percent. So, your application has been partly partly allowed, allowed to that extent. to that extent of reduction. Yes. Mean. In oh. impugn order, lots of witness consider right. in impugn Now, judgment also. Let us see you. According to you, one thirty one is arising out of the very same hmm. reference. Reference is different. Reference is different, but arising out of same acquisition. Same This acquisition. is also Sudlam Suflam. Section four also... was a common notification. Co no, different. 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 But hmm. these lands are situated so adjacent to. So when we the... get the judgment four six five four, the main judgment. Because in four six five four, perhaps main judgment is uh, kept in which matter? Four six five. Four six five four is one thirty one. Yes. Probably four double six five next matter. Yes, four double six five. Yes, four double. Because we don't have. Lord, ah judgment. yes, main judgment. Thank you, Madam. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
And uh, what is this? One thirty-four, Mr. Mahesh Patel. One thirty. The same, same group. Same. Yes, here it is that. Uh, it is there. Engagement of. Yes. Because. Judgment. It's a very small. Very small, eleven page judgment. Eleven. Three thirty three point five zero. Yes. Any reference of the uh, this reference case number in this judgment? No, no, no. But the exact same, very same finding. Para eleven. Very same judgment has been relied on for the deduction of forty percent. Mm -hmm. Para eleven. Now please come to para ten. Ten. Yes. Issue numbers one and ten. Yes, I I did. In present references, mm -hmm. claimant have examined so and so, who is. One of the claimant to be to the proceeding. He has mainly stated the acquisition officer has pronounced the award without considering objection raised by him. Them, their lands are irrigated lands and they are taking three crops during the year, including commercial crop. The land situated uh, acquisition officer awarded the compensation for the acquired land is inadequate, unfair, and unjust. But the claimant have not produced any expert evidence regarding the fertility and or potentiality of the soil, while the opponent has examined so and so, who has mainly denied the claim of the claimant. But during the cross examination, this witness has admitted that he has not personal knowledge about the acquisition proceeding. Opponent has produced photocopy of sale register of village uh, Lakhni village at exhibit so and so, but have not examined anyone to prove the sale instances. Therefore, this document cannot be considered. Admittedly, claimant have relied upon value on fixed by the land valuation committee, Palanpur for allotment of government land for the commercial and non-commercial purpose, and supported that contention, claimants have relied on the judgment of Honorable High Court in so-and-so. Case of so-and-so, where in Honorable High Court has relied on the judgment of uh, Honorable High Court in case of Sardar Sadhuwar Namada Nigam Limited, so-and-so, has held that the sale instances of the government land can be relied upon, but 30% amounts should be deducted for non-agricultural land. And in that particular case, the majority acquired land are smaller than the sale instances of the government land. And therefore, Honorable High Court has declined to deduction another 10%. Therefore, applying the ratio of the judgment of Honorable High Court in case of Amaji uh, Mohanji Thakur, present claimers are entitled for fixation of price of their land according to the sale instances of government land. Look into the Exhibit 41 and 42, District Land Valuation Committee has fixed the valuation 2,000 square meters government land of village Lakhni at the rate of 570 per square meters, which was allotted to BSNL while in the present references, major, majority of the acquired land are bigger in the sale instances of government land. Therefore, applying the ratio of judgment of Honorable High Court in case of Sardar Sadhuwar, Narmad and Nigam Limited, 40% of amount have been deducted from 570. Therefore, the claimants are entitled for 342 minus 8.50 already awarded, therefore 333.50. It is contended by the claimant that the valuation committee has fixed valuation of the government land on 20th 5, 2004, and notification under Section 4 of the Act was published on 30th 6, 2004. Therefore, they are entitled for the increase of two months, two months, and support of their contention claimant has two months increased. The court has not granted. Yes. I have not even pressed. Yes. Uh, therefore, 333.50 has been awarded. Exactly very same amount, very same judgment, which has been considered for deduction of 40%. Yes. And ultimately, page 10. 33.50 has been awarded. Yes, yes, Mr. Yes. There are the application filed by the state government. No. Where the reference court has granted the 491 rupees. That is the more amount than the penalty. No, no. What do you say about this item number 133 and the judgment which has been cited? The judgment is uh, so far as the judgment cited by the my learned friend. It is the similar. But we're looking to the facts that he. If the losses may kindly see the land, the land which is in the present case and the land which is the court has relied upon the uh, committee before, that is far distance. There is a highway is also there when the government has lost a permit me to uh, produce, produce this before. Just tell, tell us land. one thing, this map was forming part of that uh, before the reference. What you are producing now yes. was forming part of the proceedings before the court below? 
No, but the survey number was mentioned in the... Uh, Whether this document was in forming a... that or... Where is whether this map was exhibited to no. by the officer, no, whether it has been referred to by the uh, reference court in the judgment? No, I read the entire judgment, but there is no any transfer uh, of this then, map. But I find out that the land the committee has prepared the report. Which is survey number lot is 151. That is 152. That is nearby the highway. So far as the present land is concerned, it is this far away from that highway. Oh, at what so distance? We cannot realize that at what distance? At distance. Uh, uh, they say it is of the land of village Lakhni. Village Lakhni, but there is a one and a half kilometers away from that. Committee for the land which is the acquired by the uh, given by the state government. Yes, okay. but then all these things were not there before the reference code. Map was not there, but the certificate copy and everything survey number is also there. This but was exhibited, it was not exhibited. Whether the police, whether the your officer was examined, not examined. Officer Did you examine the claimant? Claimant was examined. But whether you have dislodged that issue that your land is situated at a distance of 1.5 kilometers oh, away is, from. That is not. But now, Lord, I can point out from this. Not now. That is not. Won't be permissible. Village is same, but Lord, there is a difference in the land. Even so how much difference? How, what difference? Even that is the NA land. This is not the NA land. The land which is given to the BSNL of the yes. government land, that is the NA land. Yes, this reason land is the agricultural land. Yes. So the amount can be agricultural land if there is any land, there is the amount is more. All this aspect is not. Yes. But where are those findings? Let us see. Yes, now not so far as the no officer was examined, no officer has examined the claim. Where is it? Uh, where have you dislodged? That the land of the petitioners or the appellant is situated at the distance of 1.5 kilometers. It is a agricultural land or not an any land. It, so and it is it, not, yes. yes it is non agriculture is finding is at page number 45. Page number? Page number 45. 45, we don't have any page number 45 in it this is, appeal. This is the first appeal number. It is our first appeal. It is first appeal number 110. No, so we are we are at the item number one thirty one. You don't have the papers? So for a serial number. Just collect all the papers of one thirty one. Please go through the papers. Yes. We'll keep it tomorrow. Please or the after. In fact, if this this map can be considered. Yes. Unless what has been uh, judgment of this honorable court two hundred million probably. Sir, mm -hmm. next any baju ni check kiya cha. Ap. Just give us one. We'll share. Okay, check. Check. We have copy. Yes. Yeah. So they have prepared. <laughs> but this green one, yes. green one is Red this number. Number. 152 serial number, the survey number. Survey that number? Is mark, survey number 152. It is marked by the red sketch pen. This, here, this is the highway in yes. 152. Yes. This is the land which the uh, committee has prepared the report. Yes. And the valuation committee. valuation committee. So it has now, determined that it is 2000. Uh, it is 570. Oh, 570. 570. 570 per square meter. 570 per square meter. Yes. So, so yes. far as the green portion is concerned, it is the acquired survey number. All the green, All the green the acquired survey yes. numbers. And one here. Yes. Yes. So my submission is it is a highway and it is non-agriculture land. 
152 survey now. Yes, and so far as the green portion has concerned, which is acquired very well. So, which are the lands which are covered in this judgment? Yes, Indeed. that is the serial number. No, that is the survey number 42. Judgment. This one in this, yes, this or judgment passes on 211. 211. Yes. 211. That is 211. That is NRC number of the first number 152 to 211. 211, it has been mentioned in the judgment. 211. So that is a blue, blue one. Blue one. And these, the item number 131 to 135 yes. is 212. Yes. 21221. 221. Adjacent. Yes. Very yes. adjacent of the judgment, which yes. has been. It is connected. Two one two is connected to one. This is the. This is a canal which is passing through. Yes. Therefore, that it is a canal. Yes. The purple one is the highway. Highway. Yes. 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 So therefore, my submission is the judgment which is passed by this honorable court. Is the uh, the you know we relied upon the committee report. It is not because it cannot be relied because that the difference between the land and the uh, area is also different. But it is, it is connected. It is one it point is connected. adjacent to each other. If two one two yes is to be considered, then here in yes, this case judgment is considered. Then lawyers we cannot say anything because <laughs> we have to go by this judgment. If you can find out any distinguish or point out any distinguishing feature, you can consider. But if it is not, then I can only say that the other survey number is also far from it is it is like in the end of the village. So far as the judgment of this honorable court is concerned, survey number two double one, it is the middle of the village. So what is the distance between the last survey number and this three survey? kilometers, three and a half kilometers. Three and a half kilometers. Yes. <laughs> Where is that in the judgment? Judgment that all these things are not pointed out of statute. Then, so how much difference it will make? Uh, more what difference it will make? Sir, then we wish the result. At the most, deduction. Deduction, yes. 40% to 20%. 40% to 20%. The mm. court has granted 20% in that survey number two double. My request is if it is far than three, three and a half kilometers, then Deduction may be 30% or 40%, which is granted by the trial court. It is proper. Yes. At least 131 to 135, there is no uh, what, 211. You have filed a cross objection, right? Yes, yes. Where have you stated in your uh, rounds? That the distance is uh, very less, and that is a forty percent deduction. Or my 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 say is why the forty per, instead of forty percent, twenty percent is to be deducted. My say is the the judgment. If I can point out why I have argued that twenty percent is to be deducted. What is to be seen for the purpose of deduction? deduction. Yes. Therefore, honorable Supreme Court, the judgment which I have relied that you have to see what further development we require to be done for the purpose of for which the project is to be. Uh, the, uh, the amount of the land which has been taken away what further development is required thereon yes so that the uh this can be considered and the, this land 152 Mr. Mr. that yes. land of which the valuation has been fixed by the district level valuation committee Lord, is 570 570 yes 570, yeah, 570. Yes. the other two survey numbers they are very close and connected to the highways to the highway or to the land. You can see the dis distance. Yes, yes. You can just at least. 211, your Lordship is indicating. 153 and 200. Ah, Lordship, please. Right? Lordship. 152 appears to be a bigger plot, bigger 
size of a land. It, it fact, is not a small land. It appears to be. No, uh, there are uh, pikey numbers. 153, 1, 152. No, we are concerned with the 152. 153, right. I'm saying. 152 is a land of which the district uh, valuation committee has decided has the price. The price. If you see it, 153. Lots of what is the total area of 152? 152, which has been allotted, 2,000 square uh, meters. Must be more than. 2, no, no, it is recorded. 152, Even in the judgment, the total also. area of 152 is 2,000. Out of only 2,000 has been allotted. Out of? Out of the 153, 2,000 has been uh, allotted. 2,000 has been allotted to? BSN. BSN. So that's why we are saying that what the area of 152 must be a. It must be a big chunk of land. Yes, because it, it appears be that these are government land. Government land. Government traverse land must be running into uh, kilometers. One, yes, one fifty-two total it, area 2, is. Thousand is a small square. Small. Right, we can imagine that it must be a small. Yes. Yes. What Therefore, is the total 20%. area of one fifty-two? Is a traverse land or? Two thousand square meters. It's a lot. It will be a lot. Nothing common record. What have you placed on record to ever um, to substantiate that it? Uh, the deduction should have been 50, 20 percent and not 40 percent. I only relied that there is nothing further to be done. The certificates, uh, yeah, certificates the distance, of the, the distance panchayat. Of 112 from 152 appears to be more than two to three kilometers. Not three, uh, three, three, uh, three, yeah, three and a half kilometers. Yeah, these are only two fields away. Yeah, What Lord Sim has considered this. Yes. Even the two kilometers. Yes. But then on what basis you say that your is less than I'm not kilometers. saying that this has to be all deducted 40% to 20% because even the learned reference code has deducted Mr. based Mr. on the small less. Say that the deduction should have been 20% and not 40%. Yes, because so what, is, yes. what is the evidence which you have placed on that? My say that 20% yes. is not because of the distance. No, no. My, okay, first we would like to satisfy ourselves on the facts. Understand. Then, I understand. Therefore, the therefore, the argument which yes. is to be advanced for the deduction, yes. deduction is that this is under the developed area. How do you say whatever what was the, the, the document which has been produced yes. there also and here also yes. the certificates of the no, panchayat no, no, no. over there. Yes, before the reference code. So what were the documents? Yes, the certificate of the, uh, the paper, paper. Uh, paper book. But here also, if I I have produced. If you want the reduction from forty percent to twenty percent, you need to tell us. That what were the documents to substantiate that the land no, whether this develop area or not? Yes, yes. The certificates were produced. The certificates were produced. Yes. And you are also produced. Right? Yes, yes. See, very all documents are yes. same. Yes. All yes. documents where, are same. Where are, where, are, where are those documents? But uh, my uh, tribe uh, certified copy I don't have. I have my OC. Please these are the, the paperwork. I prepare the date. Yes, paperwork. Yeah. Only uh, para twelve can be read this. Mr. Mr. Kapadia, we are I not understand. principal. Yes, sir. You 
you I, I, us, yes yes for why to 40 so, to 20 consider, person consider the facts and the yes, evidence yes. on the record yes because I pursue that, I know what are the evidence which they have produced there yes. and what are produced here. But we don't have evidence. No, no. I, I am not saying that Lord Sri may rely on my statement. I no, will no, pursue. We will definitely will pursue by also. producing paper book. The only thing is that we would like to see the document. Lord Sri, please. What document produced there and what document yes. produced here? If para 12 can be seen. Yes, para? 12. 1, 2, 12. Yes. As we have said. Above, the High Court fell in error by reducing the quantum of compensation on this basis. The reduction has been made for two reasons. One, that the present acquisition of the larger area. And second, the distance between the land under the acquisition and in Exhibit 16 is about 5 kilometers. With reference to the acquisition, question of acquisition being of larger area, the error is when we can uh, we scan, we find for the acquisition of each landowner, it could not be said that the acquisition of a larger area. Largeness is mainly when each uh, landholder land is clubbed together, then the area becomes large. Each landholders holding are of the smaller area, even otherwise. We reasoning in line with the submission for the state, we find that Exhibit 16 is about two hectares of the land, which cannot be said to be a small piece of land. So far as the other question of distance between the two classes of the land is concerned, that by itself cannot derogate the claim of the claim, uh, claimant unless there are some such other material to show that the quality and potentiality of such land is inferior. However, distance between the land under Exhibit 50, uh, 16 and the present land, even if they are 15 kilometers apart, would not relevant. The relevant could be their distance from the Viramgan town. We find, as per the map produced by the state, the present acquired land is about 3 kilometers away from it, while the land under Exhibit 16 is about 2 kilometers away from it. This difference is not much as to lead to reduce the rate of the compensation, especially on the facts of this case. In present case, we have recorded above. It has been found that the quality, including potentiality of the land between the Exhibit 16 and the present one are similar. No evidence has been laid on behalf of the state to find any difference between the two in view of this. But therefore, I understand that Lord Civil wanted to compare whether that what evidence was there and what they, whether that evidence has been produced here. I will brought that uh, yes, also. If we, if we see this map, hmm. which has been produced, there appears to be you know, the land situated in the present land reference is at a distance. It is not. If, if Lord Sibir wants again see, yes. 152 uh, yes, appears 152? to be large. And yes. 153 and 211. Yes. 211 is the... the judgment yes, 211 is the... Yes. Very okay. next is 212. Yes, yes, yes Miss Patel. I think it is an adjacent In fact, there is not a single evidence. But 333 has been originally 8 rupees has been awarded for all, both the lands. Yes. Thereafter, 333.50 awarded for the both the lands. Yes. There is also, there is not a single question put that there you have this is the, the this land is not similar to the 152. Yes. The equal, not a single question has been put by the other side, appellant. Where this honorable court is, uh, Supreme Court says there has to be. Place it on record, the paper. Right. Otherwise, this. 19th, we can keep it on. Nine. Lots. 19th. Friday. Friday. I will prepare a small paper book, Just the copy. exhibit. Yes. I may not get the true co uh, certified copy, but OCI. Only for their power. Lots. I will also uh, place it on. Also for our reference. Though. Lots. Yes. Because since you are claiming that the lands are similarly situated to the lands which are there. So that in fact, the Honorable Supreme Court, it is for the state to say whether there is a substantial difference. Yes. There is not. No, but it is now your cross objection. Yes, cross for, objection. Therefore, I, I wanted to difference. indicate to Honorable Court yes. that cross objection on the ground of not of the distance. Then, it is on the ground what other further because the deduction the further deduction is for whether that whether that uh, land is comparable or not. First thing, what further uh, development is required to be done for the purpose of this project? Mm. The this honorable court considers that judgment says that this already a developed land area mm. situated. There is no further because this is uh, Sudlam Suflam Canal is a kacha canal. Nothing to be further developed on the land. It is only the the land needs to be dug. If the industries is to be set up, if the uh, roads have to be laid, 
every then there has to be further uh, deductions mm -hmm. which is required to be done by this acquiring body here mm -hmm. this is not the case mm -hmm. therefore the 40 percent deduction is on higher side that is what the judgment has been considered this uh, canal Sujlam, Sujlam canal don't need any further development no no yes it is only a kacha canal in fact this canal is only for the recharge of the water it is not even meant for the distribution of the water. Mm -hmm. This is a recharge can also that the uh, level of the water can come up. Come up. 19. Ms. Patel, you also need to be ready with uh, your paper. Please. Uh, yes. What are the documents if I talk? You may keep this um, uh, order and the judgment. Yes, yes. Otherwise. It all can be kept. Man, um, 19. <clears throat> Uh, proceedings are arising. Yes. Whereby will not my petition under section 13 1A is dismissed. During the pendants, yes. affidavit has been filed by the husband since they are residing separately since 2011. Yes. They want to be separated. Yes. President has consented to divorce. Yes. I'm for the wife. I kind of yes for the husband. Mm -hmm. It was my petition. Where is the affidavit? Page A, my lord will find. Page number? Page A. Page A. Just a minute. Please. We don't have the papers. Yes. Can I request for two more minutes? Or two in minutes. the case, 30, 18 minutes if it is. 25th, please. 25th, great. I'm on. Approve the vote, sir. Number one, you must be ready. You can delay your options. Where is the addition of the lease of options? This is in the first uh, CA. And uh, second CA, sorry, second and third. It is arising out of the same uh, award, your lordship. The delay in the first one is of 516 days. Mm -hmm. um, I have explained, Your Lordship, uh, once the award for the uh, dismiss for default was passed, mm -hmm. uh, it was uh, they, it was prepared, but uh, because of some communication gap between there, it was Very sent for the affidavit. Please, uh, it was sent, uh, the <laughs> affidavit was sent, but it, uh, it was never received by the lawyer. Mm -hmm. So I had to again send in November 23. It was not uh, even not communicated then January 24. Mm -hmm. Sorry, September 23 and then uh, January 24. Mm -hmm. And that's why there is a delay of. Uh, The divisional controller appears to be very busy. Yes, he is not in a position to take 
at the stage of obvious objection. Yes. If you notice concerning the length of the delay, heard Miss Yuma Zari learning that it is for the applicant. You say the fourth piece? Uh, no, once the restoration, once the restoration they were, then only they will be, I'll be able to. Buy. So I have received the court papers. I have. By uh, this application, the applicant from has played from condemning the deal. Of 516 days caused in preparing the exception application seeking restoration. The seeking restoration of F of the first appeal number 2916 of 2021, which was dismissed. For warrant of non renewal of office of teaching, Miss Yuma Zavi, Line Deputy for the applicant, submitted that First appeal from that in the first F of the first appeal in the uh, caption F of the first appeal from this court from I was standing to grant something to remove the office objection within a period of four weeks. Failing which one government uh, <clears throat> the uh, caption appeal from I was directed to be dismissed. Uh, Want of for non prosecution. The office of teaching could not be renewed, <coughs> and the matter come was dismissed for default. There occurred a delay. Hmm. 
it is there after from the miscellaneous caption application what is it caption application was by owing to the full stop owing to the delay from the delay present application has been necessitated in the process form they record a delay of 516 days which is submitted that we all do that after the passing of the order necessary application after the matter comma was dismissed from the government after the matter was dismissed for default with the order dated a person to the order dated 6th of July 22 necessary application seeking restoration was prepared by the learned auditor and was mailed to the division though it was a form but was misplaced in transit they remained full stop the said aspect of our could not be communicated however gone after some time from another application was sent by the advocate somewhere in the month of september 2020 which was inadvertently gone not noticed by the divisional control and therefore gone another application was sent in the month of january 2020 in the process form there occurred a delay of 516 days in preparing the caption application it is urged that delay be non bona fide and genuine con and have been explained con the same con and become due next <laughs> pertinent be con with the order data sixth of july twenty two necessary time was granted for removal of the office objection if the time was granted of four weeks for removal of the office objection it appears that the same comma was not removed and as a result where of comma the matter got dismissed for non dismissed for non removal of office objection steps were taken of sending the copies to the divisional control twice the matter was misplaced was sent to the divisional control since the scene could not be filed but there was some communication gap from another application was filed and last to come in the month of January 2022. Considering the explanation of the form, this court comments of the opinion that the delay deserves to be conducted and is accordingly conducted. civil application is allowed civil application is allowed uh, in another two matters your worship there is a delay of 115 days 150 days. only difference is that your worship otherwise the same explanation Please, is your worship because it is a, a group matter group your worship matters. arising out of same, same of all the on length of delay all the three matters please your worship may I direct to list uh, Restoration application. Let the registry be done. Okay. Yes. Oh, last nice question.
Not so simple with contempt petition and the and against the order of uh, order of the fingers. Mm -hmm. Herein the issue is specified that the land was granted allotted for a different purpose, that is for the industry of roofing time. However, uh, after a certain period of time, we have paid application to the learned collector for the change uh, for, for the purpose of the use of land. So the learned collector has also made the proposal, and the same proposal has been uh, sent to the uh, Response number two. However, that proposal has not been, that application has not been considered of ours, against which we have preferred the special civil application in which the order uh, dated 7 10 23 has been passed. If you'll also see page number 29. Yes. Uh, in that order. So they have not decided the application. Yes, it, it has not yet been decided. However, the specific direction of deciding it within a period of three months have been granted in the same petition. Yes, yes. In that petition also, the so, statement was recorded of the learned AGP. You know, just yes. kindly see page number 29. What some decision has been taken? We are supposed to take a decision, not some decision. We are not saying now. 10% amount we are ready to pay as per the resolution of the state. We have also stated uh, in the petition also. Please. Have you taken any steps in furtherance of the direction contained in the order yes. dated 7th of October 2023 that we would like to know? If you have sent any communication and if they have, if there is an inaction on their part, then we'll consider. Yes. 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 Then why you have not filed any affidavit? Today is what? First returnable day? No. I don't make sure the comments. Yes. Okay. Twenty nine. Okay. Yes. Yes. Compliance of directions issued by the learned single judge. Yes, within a period of six weeks from the day by day. Yes, yes. 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 Sometimes the state has a filing appeal against the order passed by the learned single. Is judge. there any state grant? It is under consideration. We have to a decision is yet not taken. I so the decision not taken for what? For filing an appeal. It is under consideration. So we are not concerned with that. They are already in contempt. Um, you either you comply with the order. to the concern of office and losses. My grant a week time. They will. It is a first You are supposed to do it by six weeks from the date of the receipt of the order. Yes. Order is of November 2020. Yes. Then you have not completed. Please take instructions. Yes. A week's time may be given. A week's time may be given. 22nd. Please, Doshis. Could it be 23rd or 24th? 23rd. Please. Great. Based on the same order, non compliant with this is the order 83 and 8 sorry 84 and 85. Complied with yes, I have not received any copy of it. Yeah, you will receive it is of 12 for 2024. The order is passed by the provide a copy to the lessons. So, what's the date? Yes. Yes. In both the matters, the orders are passed. Okay. 
then it may be disposed of then what have you done how should we as per the direction of the learner, single will be application is to decide it. It is in laboratory versus because they are not entitled from it. What is also the learner single will also uh, direct them if it is a liberty against is the liberty is given. Liberty is Mrs. Smita Patel and the assistant government leader. Comment is placed on record. The order dated fifteenth uh, of April, twenty twenty-two. Very informed. The request of the petition has been rejected. Request of the petition for transfer has been rejected. Mr. Vatsal Patel, yeah. learned advocate from the state said in view of the order, in view of the subsequent development from the present application from may now be survey. The submitted as since the order has been complied with, the petitioner from does not press the present application with a liberty to challenge the same, challenge the order before the appropriate forum. Liberty is already granted by the learned civil organization. By the single is granted. Request is executed. The contempt proceedings stands closed. Are closed. Similar in the contempt proceedings are closed. Notice is discharged. Civil application. MCA, the caption application stands disposed to. Second, copy the order to the date at 12th of April. The two matters, uh, 84 and 85. 84 is 15th of April, 85 is 12th of April. Here, at least, as far yes. as the payment is concerned, page 156 that is made. Complain. Yes, you have provided them. They know that the order has been completed. Yes, in fact, it has been received. We have said on yes. our affidavit also, we have filed an additional affidavit. Yes. If part we, of the order is complied, part of the order which was in my favor, that is yet to be all complied. So, for that, it will be done. So, I will file further affidavit to them. In 93, not in 86. Yes. No, either both will, I will just indicate what. Yes. Page 156, if the Honorable Court has. I have already stated on. Oh, what my friend is probably indicating is the amount is paid. Yes. At 156, paragraph 3. Your are 156? Yes. Uh, that is my additional affidavit. Yes. Paragraph 3, I have said that this amount is received on 19 3, 2024. Yes. Then paragraph 4, pursuant to the receipt, up till now we have processed payments for 78.68 crores. Again, yes. not very. Then paragraph 5. This has to be paid to 79,000 people, etc. And then 157 is running. Yes. First line. Yes. Payments made for amounts aggregating to 21.01 crores. 235,000 could not be processed on account of bank accounts of farmers being closed or not being in existence. So we have followed up with the state. 
which they are in the process of giving. So, in fact, Manoj, my friend's uh, application is a little premature. It is 28th March when bank accounts are being asked for. Yes. So, that will be resolved, Manoj, in view of these three paragraphs. Yes. Both contempts can go. After that, Manoj, after the process of reconciliation of bank account, if he still doesn't get the money, uh, then it may be. But today, in 10 yes. days, to complain that we have not received no, in view of this gap of accounts. No purpose will be served in my submission. So, this order has been um, complied. complied. So, so, this contempt would not serve. Yes. 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 That is all yes. subject to the outcome. What do you my know? submission was that if both can go or if that is the only otherwise must it will remain as if it's an audit of what is happening. Let him come with a default. Yes. Today, Manoj, we have just received on 19th March. Yes. We have already disbursed substantial amounts of 50 or 57.66 crores. Yes. Ah, I know. 50, no, no. Of that, 57 crores is already disbursed. Yes. 21 crores, we are, there are no bank accounts. Yes. So, we are following up with the state. My friend, maybe you're in that category. Yes. So, Manoj, there is no point in my submission. Keeping the second contempt pending, let some time go by despite which if it doesn't So be, the state government has disbursed the amount. Has given to me. It was a subsidy. I have to give it immediately. That has I, been disbursed further in favor of the farmers. Whose accounts I had got? 57 crores. 50, now 21 20 crores has bound. Could not be done because. Because there is no bank account or it is closed. Or it is closed. This we are sitting with the state government and asking them give us the yes. uh, account number. So they are in the process where they are but what my learner previously is saying that the amount which was not paid is closed bank account. I'm also disputing that also because there are certain petitions are pending here in their bank account is already there. The petitioner are there, there is also there, but they have not paid any amount to them, even though it is there. Eligible uh, uh, government is said that these persons are eligible. both can yes. go by some week or whenever my friend wants. I will just put it on record, Manoj. If they are, they are eligible, then they are required to pay. If they are not eligible on that part, then they will my friend will have to come out with particulars, yes. bank accounts, demand. Then for... I will produce one all bank accounts, which is with me. I, I can produce. With, can... with the state, not to me, Manoj. Yes. We will have to give to the state. So, as a logic. What is this order? What is this talk? There's that disbursement. This will be the order. The second one is the disbursement order. One is the main order passed by the office. Other is an office order. Why don't you put it by way of an affidavit? Yes. No apology, nothing, and straight away. Yes. Place it by way of a reply. Yes, exactly. Then my friend also. Mr. Neera Sharma, learned assistant government leader from a state said the order com has been complied with. And the necessary subsidy has been released to which common Mr. Me Joshi Lanes in Council Com states that the amount has been received, out of which 57 crores comma has been disbursed in favor of the farmers. However, comma 21. Yes, ma'am. 21, 21 crores comma could not be 21.0. Yes, ma'am. 21, 21 crores. Approximately 21 comma could not be disbursed owing to the Non availability of the bank account, yes. Non availability of bank account being closed, being closed, or, or not being in existence, that is what we have, or not being traceable, yes. Uh, Mr. Neera Sharma, Mr. Pati Kajari, learned advocate, for me. you are not here in this application, no, I am here, no. I'm not in this, this application, in this application, no. well, Mr. Pati Kajari, learned advocate, for me, states that he would take necessary instructions. Uh, Mr. Neera Sharma also come a request for some time so as to place it on record. The orders by way of an affidavit. Uh, okay. Request is made for a short day. This is a matter on 23rd of it April. Just give the date number. 
this order will be only in 86. Yes. 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 Yes, you are not there when the matter was called out. Yes. Uh, in, in fact, I tried to log in. Uh, well, no, the, there was no request. Yes. What is your request? Uh, uh, now, when you sit there, we kept on 18th number. 18th. Yes. Yes. Which matter? You file it with the registry. It has been taken. Yes, Mr. Rupera was there. Maybe. It is taken on the record. Yes, yes. Yes. yes, you are also not there when the matter yes, was I, 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 sorry, yes, short because uh, 19 is a short matter. It's only one minute I want to argue. I want to documents. This completely covered here. In this 